guys how's it going you know what's really annoying right now is I went from the last two days you know <sighs> shoeing leggings wearing a shirt that's basically made of mesh blowing fans all over the place because I'm boiling hot and now I'm sitting here, the windows are closed, the fans are off, and I'm wrapped in a wool blanket because I'm cold. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> it went from... Okay, you got... You, it's, a, it's a 30 degree difference, okay? It was, it was 95 degrees over the weekend and now it's 66 degrees and cloudy. <laughs> Yeah, January. <laughs> yeah, I'm tempted to run my heater, but I don't want to live that reality at the moment. <laughs> so... <clears throat> Summer doesn't hit Washington till July 5th anyway. <laughs> All right, OPD. Well, thanks for stopping by. Ten monitors and three computers? What are you doing? I've got one computer and three monitors. They don't actually warm stuff up too much. I've got a large room. This room is like... 14 by 15 feet with 13 or 14 foot high ceilings on one end. So it's, it's a big room. It doesn't easily get warmed up by the computer. at home IT support and programming. Okay. Cool.
I am looking into trying to set up a portfolio, probably primarily using RP, but I'll have to make something too for voice work. Was dead end kids, chased Sandini, Chrissy in custody, Hearst has twisted ankles, searching for the rest. I just missed a dead end kid. Aw, oh, shame. That's fine. Incident. Rhodes Bank Robbery. Earlier today, I spoke with a civilian informant recently breaking free of minor involvement in some petty crime and looking to prove their worth to the SESD. For the sake of protecting this person's identity, I will be making their name available only in a senior deputy report, replete with the individual's telegram number in case they need to be contacted ahead or after this event. As a first point of note, the informant will not actively be participating in the robbery, nor will they be finding themselves in the company of any of the involved parties during their time as wanted individuals. This has been made clear to the informant. If they get caught up in this somehow, something has clearly gone wrong. According to our informant, between the hours of 6 and 6.30 p.m. New York time on the 28th of June, Rhodes Bank will be hit by a group of armed robbers. They believe they will be five strong, but as our informant will be excusing themselves, we'll be on the lookout for the following four individuals. Mama Christine, Forest Fish, Daisy, Jim Sky. I wonder who this is. Obviously, the above are liable to wear some manner of disguise, but I encourage deputies to be on alert to any of those for scouting out the town ahead of the robbery or simply traveling around in their own clothes. Take note of their horses at all possible to assist in identifying them in the robbery. this. Ripley. Tempted robbery by bandit in black. Huh, it's already been nine minutes, so I must have missed another friendly kidnapping. Okay. No. No. <sighs> no. Creed's Cannibals. Given the nature and activity of Creed's cannibals in the updated news section of this will contain information at the top of the dossier for one week before a move to the bottom of the report in the archived information section. The most recent news should be placed on top of older entries. June 28, Creed and company have placed oil tankers outside the sheriff's offices in Valentine and Strawberry, detonating them. Additionally, they have tortured Colin Carver. They have reportedly been riding around a large group the hours of 3 p.m. to 9 p.m. EST. I'm excited to see some Sam and Saffron interactions based on what happened. 
Yeah, that could be interesting. Speaking of which, I need to check my telegrams. Need to get weapons. I need to. Wait, I am, like, my inventory is not what it normally is. Oh no, horsey. There's time. Okay. Y'all need to calm down. You guys are like, oh no, Saffron's been kidnapped again. <laughs> Popcorn crunch. What is this? What? 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 What, what happened? Handcuffs. That's right, I put them on my horse. Just in case while I was riding alone, someone would rob me. <laughs> nope! There will be no lollipopping. I hate this term. That is the last time I'll be using it. It's not happening. Oh, guns. I mean, people could legitimately, um, decide to do ransomings more often. Sam from? Not, not happening. Happened to that door. <laughs> I just like grabbed it and then walked through it. Love from Sobs viewers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. We got nothing against uh, Sob. Oh, oh, see. Nothing against him. I see Saffron uh, would have nothing to do with Sam in any romantic capacity. I'm so cold. This sucks. <laughs> Ma'am. What was wrong with you, Chet? You just forgot about our boy Nor our boy Norman. No, we, we're we not gonna date Norman. He's a cut thug. I bet he's gonna say, Oh, you don't have to pay me, Saffron. It's a gift. Oh, okay. Send me a telegram whenever you're around and we can definitely set something up shortly. Surprise, surprise. The potato paramedic, thank you so much for that subscription. <laughs> Appreciate it. Why did this come out funny? Uh, YB638. Uh, YB638. I recommend a carriage. It might be the best for you. I know! I know! <laughs> Native is just carriage. desperate to ship okay. anyone. <laughs> Listen, I can agree. Norman's voice is very, very likable. There is nothing not likable about Norman's voice. However, there is no proof that Norman is a good person. 
In fact, there's there's proof to the contrary. <laughs> Uh, you won't find me shipping Boyd. <laughs> well, not anymore. Yeah, Boyd proved himself to be a scumbag. He may be lawful, but he ain't nice. Boyd, who? <laughs> We all know people can change with better. That is Saffron's own experience. Yep, and that is, I mean, Saffron wants to live that out. That's why she gave Boyd a chance, okay? Because Boyd uh, initially was honest with her, right? And she wanted to support that. I don't think I can ship Norman anymore. It breaks my heart as much as it breaks his. <laughs> I told you, he's a filthy criminal. Oh, I don't care about Boyd. I'm shipping Sam. Yeah, that's... Sam isn't even remotely close to being Saffron's type. I think as Norman would be Saffron's type. However, criminal. Meanwhile, Rip in Wonderland. Yeah, Rip, Rip is more Saffron's type than Sam. Defo. And he's not a criminal. Doctor and Strawberry that just drug Joey through town and dropped him off. Joey. That might be the doctors going there now. Uh, Bella? Uh, hello? Are I hear my name. I, are you in DE? I am. Alright, someone's apparently harmed on, uh, Strawberry. I'm going up there now. Oh, okay. I'll grab my horse and up we go. Bye. Hi. It's, it's Vivian, right? I'm sorry, what was that? Oh, no, sorry, I missed her. Uh, you sounded like someone else and then, then you didn't. Oh, there, there's someone else outside. Oh, okay, maybe, I'm sorry, I just maybe was hearing things. I'm so sorry. are different kind of hell. Yeah, they're pretty awful. I'm just sitting here sipping tea thinking about the some funny meta knowledge I got today. Oh boy. Thank you so much for the sub. You guys are all so amazing.
Yeah, y'all better not spill. <laughs> uh, you guys are making me nervous. <laughs> the only thing I know for sure is that the, the bloody hoods are going to be coming after Saffron if they get the chance again. I thought maybe they'd given up after, uh, <sighs> I thought maybe they'd given up, but, uh, apparently they don't consider beating her up in the cell to uh, have settled their score. What was wrong with you guys? Wink, wink. Ooh, yeah, wink. 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 It's for sure not what you think. I literally have no idea. So <laughs> I, I have literally no idea. But you sit on your meta. I don't need it. I don't want it. Is medical here? Okay, I. Oh, she is. You write that. Gonna make an honorary blood at you, Hood, because she has red hair. No, but they probably want to torture her. I already got the, you made me feel bad for kicking her because you sounded like you were actually in pain when you got kicked, DM. Ooh, I'm so cold. Man, pass out bleeding in Blackwater Medical Tents. Need doctor urgently. What on earth? I just came from there. Okay. Okay. How many doctors do we have here? Dr. Bellatrix, and then we also have the. Are you, are you still a trainee or Adler? Yes. Or? Yeah, okay. I'm still a trainee, yes. Yeah, because right, we just got word. I just, we just got another telegram saying that there's someone passed out and bleeding in the Blackwater medical tents. Oh, that's new. We were just well, there. I yeah, no, just... It, it just came. It just came in through the tip lane since we left. So it, it's probably literally as soon as we left town. All right. Um, we do have another one who was, was on duty. Uh, All right. I'll go. Seen. I'll go send for him. Oh. Oh. I'm sorry, Thor. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. <sighs> yeah. Just get that handled. Do you need me for anything, or do you, uh, or is it okay if I stay here and I get his no, statement? No. Go ahead and stay there. I, I was right. coming here just in case that was needed. But. Fingers when they're supposed to go, okay? Hey, Bionic. Oops. I need to send this through.
I'm convinced that's how she tells people she likes them with a good strangle. No, because I, I did that to Jack Kevlin like twice in a row, remember? You can't start shipping Jack Kettleman and Zaffron. The OG Cameron. Thank you for the follow. Wild RP released some new tutorial videos and it's interesting to know your player icon on the minimap is white when friendly and red when PvP. Yeah, it is. Uh, that's how I know which way it is. Doesn't mean that I don't, you know, mess up when hitting the wrong key. I just need to make it key bindable to toggle PvP quicker. Yeah, to agree, although I, I'd agree, but then they might need to put it on a cooldown crypt because I've seen on servers where people will use that to abusively win uh, fist fights and stuff. Because what they'll do is they'll um, like tap in and out of PvP. Does that make sense? It, it makes it harder to engage them or something like that. Then maybe more people walk around friendly. Yeah, that too. Oh no. Her traps. Do we know what happened? No. Are either of you doctors? No, ma'am, no. I'm just a friend. But you don't know what happened? Who is this? Toby would know. I'm Charlotte Davis. This is Nate. Casey. That's Nate there. Oh, sorry, I can you see him. Side of face gashed and bleeding as well. Nate, what happened? Very large cuts going across two scars. Toby! Um, it's, um, is that Billy in there? Toby, what Toby, happened? what happened? I found him, I found him in the play, in the freaking plains, all, all banged up. Is gashes it, and cuts. I think it's the cat. Do you think it's the cat, or do you think it's something else? The what? One of the cougars. at the saloon. It's no, Toby. no, no. I mean, it's, no, it's he... Nate. What happened? I don't, we don't on. know. So Where was he? I need... Where was he? What the fuck happened? Okay, let's put the gun down in time. I'm sorry. Thank you. I'll be back.
Okay, this door is so annoying. I mean, at least this server has the has the rag doll on a key binding. That way, you can actually break out of those auto grips. You don't have to rely on typing something. Hey, Saffron, do you want to do me a favor if you, if you can? What's that? Could you just apply pressure to? This is cut, and this hand will get you some bandages, and just here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pack tightly, pack everything that I can on him, while we okay, wait perfect. for the medical to arrive. There's some medics up in Strawberry, but they're dealing with something else. So hopefully another one can come here soon. Okay, okay. Um, I'll grab you some um, bandages and rack and stuff. The wounds are have been cleaned by this little lady over here. Nate. Can I rub his head? Ah, uh, sure. I mean, it's probably not gonna hurt. He's got some pretty, pretty deep cuts on his hands and on his face. Why? Looks like he got tortured. Nate! We'll get him taken care of. You said you wouldn't leave me too. Nate, please. Where, where does the worst wound here? I know no on his face and his hands, eh? He's really pale. I know. I'm gonna go check. I'm gonna just chase this <laughs> buffalo to death. <laughs> Sorry. Telegram. Update on situation in Blackwater. Please send word to Damn document. telegram all over again. Sorry, I'm trying to get people here for a medical emergency. It's my apologies. <laughs> oh. No, you can't. He's just being dramatic for RP purposes. Anons. How's he looking? Did I've, you send anons? I've packed his wounds I've, I've on his sent, hands on his head. I've sent directly for medical. Okay, okay, okay. We've, we've packed all his wounds. Hopefully the doctors can get here and start helping him. I don't have the doctors. Howdy. 
You're supposed to take me on another carriage ride. He's right there. Nate? Oh, oh, God. Bad. Nate? He's got some oh. bad cuts. Billy, I need you to, to step out of the way. Everyone, please move out of Billy's way. She's going to start taking okay, care of him, okay? okay. I know you all care and everything, but we need, we need people to give her space. Howdy. Howdy. I uh, over here, okay. Rip. It looks like Nate's been tortured and dropped off here. Uh so. Nate? Aye, it's Nate Kesey. Okay. Uh Toby said he found him in the field outside of Kerrigan Ranch. Aye. He's got rope burns on his wrists. Deep cuts on his hands and face. Any uh, any markings or, or just cuts? I, I'm not sure. I'm gonna have to wait till the doctors have dealt with him. I think. I'm gonna start All writing right. up a report about it. Though. I think I'm gonna go ahead and wrap your hands and then move on to your head for a moment. See what this gash looks like. Hmm. All right, sorry, Toby, Aurora, the Billy. Hi, they're all his friends. Uh, did you know the, the other one that was standing out front with you, Justin? Uh, who? The lady just over, uh, over yonder. Uh, I'm not sure it could be Jojo. Um, I'm not sure. Oh, possibly. Let me have one more inside with him. No, we're, we're good, sir. Thank you. All right, then.
first thing I want to check, I want to make sure your jaw is still in one piece. Because if it's shattered, we're dealing with wiring it shut. Talking and eating would become difficult. So complications that are very, very life altering for you. Uh, just a moment outside. Hi. I don't know if you saw the report from uh, Lake earlier. No way. It so was uh, he was robbed by two uh, uh, two of the summers, Shaw and Blondie, uh, just here in, uh, Shaw in and Blackwater. Mm -hmm. Here in Blackwater. They were here in Blackwater. He followed them. They had someone tied up, and then he went around the corner. He had a gun to his face. They uh, robbed him of uh, well most of his things, but how long ago was that? Earlier today. I, okay, well, I mean... Like, maybe... Anywhere from six, seven hours okay, ago. Okay, so quite, quite some time ago mm -hmm. today. Okay. Um, there was a report from... Uh, uh, I believe Pavis put in... Uh, information she gathered from Corner. A uh, shootout between... Uh, Kettleman and Summers in... Uh, uh, nearby Tumbleweed. Sorry, between who and Summers? Uh, Calman. So, Jack. Uh-huh. Uh, James Kelly, Aurora, Nate, I want to say as well. So you think that they might be coming after Possible them? Possible retaliation. Maybe. It's possibly Nate will be able to offer some insights. But we'll see if he's gonna uh, play the. Uh, not gonna give you any information, even if he remembers anything. Well, Jack alluded to the fact that uh, when we took him in in Annisburg, that. he was saying to Marty that you'd be proud of the uh, the cattle kids. That they uh, they uh, did something he he wasn't able to. And then he was was talking about the summer solstice. Considering they rode in, um, asking for a woman in a pink corset, and then the shootout in Tumbleweed. I'm safe to assume, uh, maybe, maybe the Summers gang isn't doing too hot, and they're coming through picking them off. It's possible. Do you have this, these observations written down anywhere? Uh, there's a report okay. detailing it all. In fact, I'll uh, I'll pull it up to the the top for Two of them have uh, been put up here. Howdy. Um, I'll let Mitchell. Uh... Oh. All right. Uh, so that's Nate Casey in there. He was apparently found out near the ranch. Uh, He's got deep cuts to his face and his hands uh, and rope burns on his wrists. It looks like he's been picked up and tortured, though we don't know by who or uh, anything beyond that at the moment. Uh, Rip is speculating that it could be retaliation from Summer's game because it sounds like uh, the quote-unquote kettle kids might have been involved in a shootout with him or something. Yeah, I, um, I can almost confirmed that in the conversation I had with him. Mm -hmm. I was actually just about to tell Lewis before that bank robbery happened earlier. Sorry, so we we don't know, though, we don't have anything saying whether this is Somers gang related or not, but apparently, uh, was it Shaw and Blondie, you said? Mm -hmm. Two of the Somers gang members were here in town robbing people earlier today. 
Okay. So, I don't know if they were robbing people in general, but they definitely well, had they one robbed, person tied right, up. They had someone tied up. Do we do we know who that I person don't, was? No, uh, there was no description from uh, Lake about okay. who, who was on the shoulder, but mm -hmm. we can try and reach out to him and find out. In fact, if we uh, ask the doctor how long of a time frame the, the rope burn was looking. You think it, it might have been him all the way, you know, six or seven hours ago? That's a very long time for people to cat. They typically, I mean, not saying it's impossible, but mm, it's not. I mean, uh, yeah, never know. No, I, I agree. You never know. I'm just, it's not typical is all I mean. Severe. Is his um, jaw broken? Yes. Um, I'm going to need to uh, adjust this. There's a few fractured pieces. Okay. Just let us know if you need anything. Alright. For a second. Nice. So, I was trying to tell Lewis this just before we came out here. So, I had a conversation with Nate at one point uh, while he was sitting in a cell. And the things that he was alluding to lined up with something that Jack was alluding to when we took him to Sisica earlier in that day. And what it sounds like is that a bunch of them did get the drop on Summers. Um, don't know where, but, uh, that was what was being implied pretty heavily. And the only people I know that seem to maybe line up with that is Jack mentioned Monroe would have been, or not Monroe, Malone would have been very proud of um, Aurora. Hey. Well, I think that's and what Rip was talking about with this uh, Summer's Gang versus Catman Gang at Rathskiller Fork. Instead. That might be it. Yeah. And there's been several things that have alluded to the fact that they've been involved, which is why we're saying it's very possible that this could be Summer's Gang retaliation or something. But yeah, I had asked him about that, and he seemed like they were um, definitely bracing for it. He was alluding to something probably coming in the days coming following it, and quite honestly, this is a little under a week since it happened, I think. I, I just the so. one thing that would have me cautious is it it doesn't seem yeah to no, be I'd... very much their style the summer's game mm -hmm. style usually if they they take someone and they do something they're brazen and bold about it they drop them off in the middle of town you know at least that's been their pattern so far yeah so that's that's the only thing that would sort of make me think maybe not but mm. then again who knows i mean you know if they're angry enough about something they might yeah. change how they operate i i, I don't can i mean i guess he's not going to really be able to talk all that much otherwise i was going to say i can try talking to him again but probably not in that boat well you can always try yeah if i'll you hang can't, around you can't, if not, can. we ha we'll have an investigation going on it so yeah i'll, I'll see what i can find out i've uh, I've talked with him quite a bit, so nice. if he's able to, so then... I have started the, uh, I've started, started, uh, insert report on it, so if you find anything out... Yeah.
I, like the scoop patrolling in Blackwater, heading south on Main Street when I spotted two individuals heading east behind the Moving Pictures Theater, one with a person roped up on their back. I approached cautiously, only to have one of the two round the corner with a rifle pointed at me before I could draw my weapon. I stated there was no need of violence, to which yeah, he agreed. From what Toby said, he uh, didn't seem to appear to have been there for too long, so... Aye, all right. Uh, it was only when he arrived at the tent where the office here, his condition worsened. All right. The other, whom I presumed was placing the person in the back of their horse, asked if I had been searched, which I hadn't, and he came around to cut me free. I kept my hands up, worried they'd draw on me again if they took... And they took from me $24 and four handcuffs, my fifth set used on me as they left. All while searching me, they spoke. Do you know who we are? I'm sorry, I don't really know, unfortunately. I'm Sean, this is Blondie. I see, Summer's Gang. A few quicker inconsequential exchanges were given, but the severe point was that the woman who was on the back of one of their horses, blonde hair, pink corset, dark pants, matching the description in a previous report of Aurora. This has to do with a shootout reported to Senior Deputy Pavis regarding the shootout at Rathscaler Fort between the members of the Kelman Gang and Summers Gang. They rode off south, leaving me handcuffed, of which I was unable of which I was able to find a kindly man, Dolphy, who fished the keys out of my pocket to uncuff me. So Aurora's fine. Hmm. Alright. Hmm. From Lake's description, it sounds like Aurora is who they had. Did you read that? I didn't see that detail about Aurora okay. being there. Which, Aurora is here and running around. She's not been harmed. Reckon so. it's worth the uh, question. Aye, we should definitely try and talk to her about that. Uh, here, let me read this. It says, uh, uh, but the severe point was a woman who was on the back of one of their horses. Blonde hair, pink corset, dark pants, matching the description of a previous report of Aurora. This has to do with the shootout report to Senior Deputy Pavis regarding the shootout at Rathskeller Fort between members of the Catlin Gang and Summers Gang. I'll, uh, I'll go try and find her. Sure, aye. Have you seen where, uh, Aurora went? Okay. Any, uh, indication as to where she went, or...? Oh! I miss this tent stuff. Uh, used to RP wolf fan. Who are those other two people? Uh, the two right there. Yeah, the rib's talking to. Uh, that's. The win in blues, Billy Blasters. The last might be, uh, might be Lottie Davis. Okay. I don't think I've met either one of them. I've heard Billy, though. Uh, neither of them have seen. Uh, she was just here in town. Okay. I'm gonna go check my telegrams real quick. Uh, they huh. did say that she'd be back here momentarily. Okay. Bye. Not sure which, uh, direction she had it. I'll wait here. Hi. In fact, I don't know if you heard of an ARC RP server called Gunsmoke. I mean, I've heard of ARC RP, but no specific servers because nothing I ever really, uh, nothing I've ever participated in.
Uh, he said, sure, let me know when you're around, we can arrange something. Because I said I can pay him back. I'm pretty sure I read it on stream earlier. It was a Wild West RP server, voice RP and all that fun stuff, though it did get really tense between Blom and Outlaws because it started to become a PvP we had a win our deal. Has a bulge in the vest from Second Pistol. <laughs> I can see your Second Pistol from all the way over here! What did Michael want from Zaf? Saffron telegrammed him saying she needed to talk about something, but we prefer to tell him in person. So he said, yeah, I'll be sh I can talk to you, I'm gonna leave. Yeah, I guess it's just a waiting game for him to uh, wake up. Mm -hmm. <sighs> My. Not too much we can do. Especially if I haven't heard anything that gives us any concrete leads, unfortunately. I'm gonna go back to the office and check the tip lane real quick. Okay. Goodness. Young group on the move. Group of five dressed like clowns here in Strawberry. They seem shady, just left headed towards Blackwater. Dead and kids were dressed in Strawberry, changed clothes, and headed west to Blackwater slash Tall Trees. Only Thorn and myself were here, so we couldn't do anything. Missy, the Wallaby kid, looked like maybe Goldie and some other blonde fellow, along with the Irish guy with a beanie on. They were on three horses, five of them. Don't apprehend alone. Make sure you have numbers. Need Dr. Valentine. Need Dr. Valentine. Now we'll pay everything I have. Just get someone to get here. Anything on the uh, on the top? Oh wow. Um, I there's. If you're not dealing something, please come to Strawberry. Need four kidnappers. We're going to Big Valley, and we have other places to chat. Dead body. We. Awkward. Johnson and Michael seems to be dead. We probably need to leave Neat and the doctor's right. hands and go deal with things. Oh wow, this door is getting in trouble. <laughs> I didn't. I couldn't even see. It. Okay, okay. Oh. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna go oh. out the back door. Can oh, you lock oh, this? Oh. Not. I I'll grab her if you want to send a tip. Uh, sure. Hey. Right.
All right, we need to get up to strawberry. Okay. Oh, there's a uh, rips coming. Okay, let's go on. Uh, they said appears to be dead. Down. Going down. Alright, we've got three. Perfect. That's all six. Thanks. Mount up. I'm gonna grab some ammo really quick. Yep. Anybody else need ammo? Uh, I can good, grab extra spools. From what we went we through the other day. Yeah. Just waiting on Thorn, she's sending the tip. She knows what's going on, so I'll go ahead and tell y'all. The people that kidnapped Joey Crawford, he heard them say they were going to Big Valley next to meet with someone. Okay. So, we're going to go check Big Valley. We also have a couple other spots to check as well, including the ranch north of Window Rock. Um, and also, of course, Emerald Ranch itself. Alright. So... We're gonna do a round. Hi. All right. All right. Thorn, I'm gonna let you leave. I believe it's Big Valley in general. Yep. Let's hit all the high spots. The full six. Full Aye. six. Okay, so one, two, two, one. I want to also, when we get done with Big Valley, hit that Window Rock Ranch and Emerald Ranch. Guns out there, wolves up here. And these people will shoot us. Do we have any idea who they might be? Yeah, it's Hotland Crew, LS Boone, and all of them.
Yeah, no, we were supposed to cut over. Yeah, I don't want to go this way. Sorry about that. I normally don't come up here from Strawberry itself. We'll go back down that way. Yeah, we'll go out through the, uh, the southeast valley. exit. Yeah, sorry. The flying elk have nested for the night. Nested? What is wrong with all of you? Isn't this the where we're supposed to be going? Wait, which uh, which way are you trying to go? If we uh, go to the right out here, they'll go towards Big Valley. Ah, uh, okay. Mm -hmm. yeah, I was gonna go towards the southeast. If that works. Some completely period, oh, right. period incorrect uh, ride out music If you can. Oftentimes there's a snake right up here at this corner. Uh, did anyone just hear someone cough? I thought I heard someone coughing up on the rock there. Uh, I thought it was a check? creature, but we can call out. Yeah, we need a little double check. Right. State's Cross and Sheriff Department, if you're injured and need help, please call out. Saints Cross the Sheriff's Department, anyone in need of medical? Hello, I think it's a good chance we heard wildlife. Yeah, it sounded like it came up from uh from Maple is currently. <laughs> me back to my DJing days. <laughs> uh, I've been double checking just in case because I. What do they call this? EDM. Someone when we have winners. Oh. That's okay. All right, let's form back up. Better safe than sorry. Yep. All right. For sure. Go down off to the right here. Go snake off yeah. to the right side. Careful. Oh Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. This fucking snake needs to find a new home. Yeah. Right. It's <laughs> that's a constant hazard. Okay, really? Calyx 2! You're a gigantic roadster. That's a wee sneak. Alright, everybody's all back in a row. Oh god. Nope. Watch that crate. Where are we trying to go? To, to yeah. the ranch? Yeah, we're going through Big Valley. Probably we want to check uh, what Hanging Dog and the ranch itself. Aye. Uh, we, can I go, maybe recommend sticking to the tree line. Right, Got a bit of coverage in case they're watching. EDM Electro house ish kind what of music. Hear us. Yeah. I see us. We do bring the thunder. Mm -hmm. Just watch for the movement. 
because there's a herd of pronghorns running around in front of us. Blowing up the top. I don't see anybody. Well, there is a barn. But a lot of these types also uh, shoe their horses with. Okay. Well, if we don't see anything, we'll go on in. We'll take a closer look for now. Out the house in the barn. Saints Crossing Sheriff's Department. If there's anyone inside, name yourself. Don't see anyone through the back windows. Bottom floor looks clear through the windows. Left side clear. It's on the floor here. Some shoes. We got this door on the left. We got a door down here. Where'd the sheriff go? Oh, she's around the right side. Yeah, did you find something? No. I just went uh, to know where everyone was. Okay. Gotcha. Yeah, and the fox sitting in. House is clear. Do we clear the barn already? Aye. Yeah. So, very good. Put the fox the in and we should uh, check on horn. Yeah, absolutely. Looking for the cave. Uh, she's not looking at a pronghorn. Oh. Yeah, we were gonna do the ranch, but if you want to do the cave, we can do that no. too. Oh no, I was just wondering what you're looking for. The ranch is almost directly southwest from where we are. Southwest. Okay. Right, and there's gonna be there could be a bear in the tree line here. So. Yeah. I probably directly west. I think. At this point, yeah.
There are a couple buildings here that can be cleared. Yeah, well, it's the barn in this one, right? I think there's there's two barns on them, this one. Okay. All right, let's clear the house first. Same Charles and Jeff. Go ahead and move the first barn. Okay. Okay. Clear. Saints Cross and Sheriff Department, anyone inside? It's looking pretty clear from uh, right here, but there is an upper floor, maybe. I got your back. Don't see anyone up on this top level. Hey, loft is also clear. barns here. Now you guys wanted to check that uh the window rock ranch, I believe it was. Oh the window walk rock window walk. Window walk? Window window walk wench. Window walk wench. <laughs> Aww. as well here or do we want to just go straight to the ranch uh that was it's been like what an hour since they said they were doing that yeah maybe we should go check that ranch okay. and then go over to emerald all right I sure hope she doesn't try and go th over all the, the rail tracks. I wouldn't be surprised if Wallaby and Minco went down to New Austin. It's what I kind of wanted to. Mm -hmm. Especially since they came through Strawberry. Yeah, I watched them all change clothes and all that. They waved to me. Mm -hmm. Hello. Well, that's where oh, they went, went before, so... There's a bear to our left, by the way. Yeah, careful. Okay, he's minding his business. Hey. My favorite kind of bear. Nice. The one you barely see. Ah. Ah. Uh. I mean, there is a way to continue yeah. from here. I to okay. That's not ideal, but you'll come out. Uh, you know, you have to go up past Lake Isabella and Barrel Lagoon. Sorry, this is the area I'm pretty much the weakest. Um, okay. No, we can go back uh, south and just continue through that road. Um, unless you do want to go up through the nice. Lake Isabella, I really don't think we should though. Probably best we double yeah. back. We could yeah, we'll back. we could go from here up to the top of Mount Hagen, see if they're hiding up there, and come down by Willis Station, and then continue. That's on not the road. a bad idea. No, right. that is not uh, a bad idea. Okay. In that case, I'll put do you want me to out. show us a, a route up the mountain? Do you? Uh, yeah, that would be great. Do you have anything, Rip? 
Sorry. Oh, we're gonna have to be quick. We'll be quick. Uh, it won't take very long. Aye. Yeah. Alright, slow it. down here. We're going slow right. Down, and we're going right. And please go single file and follow exactly where I go. Exactly where Mitchell goes, please. Looking clear up here. Slow down. Alright, slow down. Slow down. Pick yeah. your way through the camp. Be careful here. Go off to the right so you don't lose it. Alright, again, single file, full exactly where I go, please. Single file, exactly where Mitchell goes. not as sheer as it looks right here. Not as bad as it looks. And then only go down this wee area right here. Only go down right here. Everybody good? Mind the rocks here. Careful of the rocks. Yeah. Alright, we're getting back on the road right here. Alright, slowing down to a stop. Slowing it down, slowing to, down, a down stop. to a stop. Slowing down to a stop. Alright, Thorn, if you want to resume lead, if you follow this road that direction, we'll eventually go to that ranch. Okay, perfect. Are we all good to go? Mm-hmm. Alright, picking it up. When we get to that ranch, I want to spread out to check the whole place. Alright, we'll do. Probably best to go uh, staggered. Because these roads okay. get narrow. Staggering. Yeah. 
Rider. 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 <laughs> I take the take the east route. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's where we would have come out if we went all the way up past Lake uh -huh. Isabella and past uh, the, the lagoon. Oh, they're not lagoon. I really need to practice these routes. Oh, the snake. Hi, it's a... Uh, it's pretty remote out here. I only know the routes for treasure hunting and stuff before I was alone in it, so. Right? It is gonna be a little path that goes off up here. Aye, you'll, you'll see it. Uh, yeah, I believe it's ghost. before the bridge, so. I thought it was after the bridge. You might be, you might be correct. I can't even remember exactly. My directions are horrible. I just it's know, near a bridge. I believe that I believe the bridge is on the other side of it, <laughs> but we'll see. You know, it's near a bridge. It, it is near bridge. a bridge. That is correct. I'm glad we're feeling really confident about this route. Well, it's it's alright. You you can't even miss it if you go this way. So. Right. The sheriff is correct. Oh, that's near a bridge. <laughs> Although okay, I think there's a, there's a few. Oh. Water dripping off is everything looks great. I don't think they're up here. Okay, all around the Bummer. <laughs> Saints Cross and Sheriff Department. Is there anyone inside? If there's anyone inside, please make yourselves known. you covered if you went to check open that loft. Oh, nothing. There it is. Oh, that's up. So? Oh. Oh. <laughs> ah! There's a crate here. Ah, honey! <laughs> Let me look at the crate. I want to look at the crate. I found the crate. All right. <laughs> Just kidding. There's nothing in the crate. You could just shot about by the ladder. <laughs> it was clear in there. I've okay. not checked this house, but... Alright, nothing this time. These, um... I mean, it wasn't recreated from scratch. They use the maps from from the um, game. I believe there's usually one. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's always here because that's what Lily cooks on when I'm up here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got it. Alright. Um Hi, there's a there's some there's a crate inside the barn too. So there's there's people here regularly up here. Yeah, this is where Jack Thompson and we have Beth Ryder, Jack Thompson and all them. I see Jack in a hot minute. Yeah, I haven't either. Hmm. So what do we think about the dead-end kids? Do we think that they might have I gone out west? I think they're in West? New Austin. I think there's no way they're not in New Austin right now. I think we check Emerald Ranch for this group, and then... 
We go to Valentine. We check tips. If there's nothing pressing, we can go out to New Austin if y'all want. Okay. We might be worth Valentine, to go. Then Emerald or Emerald That's what I was saying. I was about to say it might be worth going through Valentine first, mm -hmm. just to see if, if we can get anything off before we're chasing ghosts to Emerald. Yeah, that's true. I right, we'll have to right. if we want to go back to Valentine. Then we we best go back down the way we came and cross the Dakota down more because there's not good crossing areas and this spot you right. can't even get down to the tracks very well. Okay, would you recommend going all the way down to Catvale or is there a, a good spot to cross beforehand? Oh, uh, there's some places you can cross there, but it's not too much further to go to, I think, just past I think past roughly where it, it says Dakota River, right? Uh, where it says west right there, you know, uh, uh, Grizzlies West, at the end of the word there, there's a path that goes down and crosses the river. That's a pretty good place to go, I think. Okay, a little so skinny bridge is somewhere too. Mm -hmm. Just nearby the Dakota River. Yeah. At the bridge. Okay. And it goes right behind Valentine. I'm pretty sure we can get actually get down. We can. Like, just, yeah. just like over there. Yeah. It's the way I usually come up here. All right. And that's the, oh the skinny the skinny bridge is near the RN River at the end, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. You should say a little block on the, uh, the water. Directly down. That? Yeah, they're real. Uh -huh. Very good, Maple. <laughs> Did he just say, is that a horse? <laughs> I, said, I, said, I said, that's a horse. <laughs> and that's okay. a tree, uh, and that's a rock, that's a and that's a bush. And it's a saddled horse. And good job, Rip. That was a bird. Right. Right again. God bird damn it. Explain right it. It's your whole bird. I haven't trained you all so well. You know, you hate me. <laughs> Please don't find the bridge. Please don't find the bridge. Uh, it's a stupid a bridge ways. to cross on horses. Yeah, I think it's further down from what I saw. I can't say it's once you cross that little wooden bridge. Come on, dumb horse. Yeah, most horses would be terrified to cross such a bridge. Correct.
what'd she say? Idea who those are on the right by the uh, church? By the church? On the two horses? I I just can't really see. I don't have any clue, but they're being pretty loud. Saw a dead body tip, to Can someone give what happened? Richard to ride you to Staples? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Okay. okay. Well, it was just uh, over there, Rich. Just, just over there. Where? The body is still in there for me. I'm filming the tent lane. A lot. Aqua Johnson's dead. Aqua Johnson. Oh, is he really? Apparently. That's, that's what's on there, yeah. That one went the east of X. Mm-hmm. Forty young adults, two women, two men, had an east from one X. Well. Yeah, when I got here, he was. I think I already lost a lot of My horse is stuck in the mud. I tried to. But, uh, uh, I'm gonna need just a minute, but if y'all need to head out immediately, just leave me behind. I'm sure we can take a few minutes. Yeah. I can let uh, sheriff know. Um, I didn't really check it's like I, I saw how much he was bleeding so i packed him and i sent them another tip like another telegram more urgently well unfortunately i had no indication that the other doctor on duty was responding to blackwater so i was halfway to blackwater by the time by the time i learned that i needed to move out so i i don't know um yeah, the body's still there, I think, unless the Undertaker's grabbed it real quick, um, but I, I don't know. The nature of the injury is pretty clear. Okay. I'll get notes from you soon, Locke, or somebody will, so... Yeah, I'll just leave a, I'll leave a copy on that uh, under the door. I'll slip it under the door. I appreciate it. Yeah, no worries. We are basically the only ones around right now and have multiple gangs riding out kidnapping and robbing people so we've been out chasing and we're probably about to go back out okay well i am here for y'all anything you need um i will try to jump to it do you yep. have remedies to taking clipboards and maps out of your stuck hand i got too much maple syrup <laughs> take a brief nap yeah i do yeah mm -hmm. Hurst needs, yeah. needs a few minutes. So. Alright, I need to take a nap then as well. Or leave. Um, I will be right back. Yeah, How many of y'all are there on duty uh, at the minute? What was that? Uh, in total. How many, yeah, how many of y'all are on duty, like, right six. here in this group? There are six people six. on duty in the state right now. It's literally Are there this. five that are here right now or six? There are all six, six of us right here. We're all here. Okay, if y'all are still here in a minute or so, I'm gonna go bring back some Ow. tonics. Oh. Hey. Ow. Some Easy. tonics for y'all. That's not Easy. my horse. <laughs> Ooh, are you okay, Mitchell? Oh, uh, you have to take yourself down. over. I'll be fine. Oops, sorry. All right. 
Yeah, so it's possible that Lewis knows about the bridge issue, but again, the bridge issue is an issue with the department. No one has bothered to bring it up with Saffron. Which is always a sad story when your characters are RP'd around and not with. No, I I basically say that I was able to dodge the brunt of the blow when it's horse kicks, because otherwise you'd just be brutally injured from horse kicks all the time. Sorry. Howdy, yeah, yeah. So the cheese was bad, and I couldn't believe the cheese. Yeah, realistically, the only reason you would ever need to cross some of those bridges is. Oh, I'm sorry. I appreciate that. As if you were in direct um, pursuit. And they crossed it ahead of you. All my precious time. Can't confirm. Time is a precious girl. She's my good baby. My little old lady. The, uh, the uh, Lewis is looking at reports at the moment, but we're going to Blackwater and then we're going to check out thieves and stuff. Blackwater thieves. Okay. Yeah. I'll send the stuff. Mm -hmm. Seriously, roots are not. Of course, I don't know why it's so hard for people. I'm wondering if that same woman who uh, earlier. Cannibal o'clock. What do you mean by oh. that? Faye just walked into the medical office. She wanted. Is, wait, Fee? Like mm -hmm. Morgana Fee? I'm not sure what her first name is, but. Are, yes. Are you saying that she's, she's a cannibal? She's white. I, I don't think she's wanted, well, she's but a that blood is. Blood letter, but, uh, she, she is. More she more. is. Yeah. Oh. Mitchell? I? Bees? Sorry, I think I think we just got attacked by bees. Uh -huh. Yeah, both of you. <laughs> uh-huh. I heard that from you, that's for oh. certain. Yeah. Um, I. But she's not wanted right now, right? She's a blood letter? She, no. Yeah, something to that effect. Okay, I don't know. That, she explains, that explains all her questions about blood last night. Mm -hmm. She was asking me if I'd help her out with a blood donation. I said, they've told me that my blood wouldn't help anyone. Ugh. Yeah, she said she has some sort of blood condition. Aye. Great. Uh, Rip went to send a tip about us heading out towards Blackwater and Thieves. Excellent. Um, so yeah, I can't take a bath we'll in this town. Where's our fifth? Oh, there she is. Excellent. I'm good. Yep. Fuck, it's stuck in my head again. God. Fine, do paperwork while we ride. <laughs> if, if only that were possible, I'd do it all the time. <laughs> I felt like I've been doing it this entire time. I feel like the amount of horse accidents we would get into <laughs> if we could do paper fork while riding. Hurry up, lead us to Blackwater. Alright, one, two, two, one. So 
already Saints Cross and Sheriff Department coming through. Hardness. Hardness. Apologies. Sorry. Anybody else see that person's hair? Okay. <laughs> All right. Oh no, Maple, your horse has issues. Oh no, I'm sorry. Well, Maybe drop to back. last information. Yeah, Thorn, switch with me. Sorry. He'll drop to last and then we'll fix it when we get to play. Night. Uh, Alright, I think I heard some haddock. Not helping. Ah! Fuck you, too, Slapjack. Good cause morning, Wake Up. Let's get you again. His talk, sorry, you know. <laughs> Yes, it does. It does damage the gun's condition. Good thing I get free gun oil. Did you enjoy your bath, Maple? It didn't, didn't really go as planned. No, the back no, is still it very did not. dirty. Cop, dad, fucking. I, neither relax. did mine. Relax. One of the reasons I struggle to stay in Valentine is because I can't you take baths in that town. Yeah, I tried to and they tried to put spiders in it. Well, considering most of the people who run that bathhouse tried to murder me at one point, um, hmm. I don't really want some sort of Sweeney Todd bathhouse situation. Mm -hmm. You heard about the bath bomb, right? <laughs> I, I, I absolutely did uh, from the mouths of the French themselves. No. No. <laughs> no. I never went and meet the French again. Just being honest. Didn't you get this cleaned up after the shootout with a uh, tight pan? I cleaned mine earlier. Took uh, around 20. Goodness. Yeah, same, different case, vials. Yeah, same case for mine. Mine isn't too bad, but I was cleaning it during the shootout, so. Oh. Rip, you do know you basically made me, like, deaf in my right ear for the rest of that night, yeah. My apologies, close quarters. <laughs> Fun. Hey, there's not too many who can say that they've been in a shootout that lasted over an hour. So good job. You stayed on your feet too. It's the second one. That one in Armadillo lasted upwards of an hour, right, Thorn? And Rip? I guess you were both there. That was a really, really, really long one, yeah. <laughs> <coughs> Alright. Continue on. Alright. 
one, two, two, one. All right, I gotta stay in the back. Mine, please. By the way. <laughs> Every time I hear by the way, it's my first thought. Uh, well, you know that Thorne's got a Kettleman impression that she does, you know? I know. Yes. Thorne, every time you say by the way, you gotta, you gotta go to Kettleman. Make it a sharp right. Aggressive right. Oh, no, first. Think first bounce. Oh, dear. Aye, she did. I'll wait for her. Is she okay? Yeah. Paris, you're slowing us all down. I'm cutting. Are you okay? I'm fine. I'm gonna stay in Blackwater if y'all are going out. It's not my night. Oh, really? I'm having such bad headaches. I'm seeing things. I'm not seeing other things. Oh, dear. Mitchell will head to the office. Uh, okay, Lois and Lorna head to Telegram and Maple's to get his horse. Hi. Right. This track sounds too much like there's like backup beepers in it. I don't know. Like it's aggressively. I when the horses feel like they're in town, they don't have to run as fast. Hi. rich kids and roads are destroying the reputation of the fair town by playing that incessantly awful fiddle a canny. That sounds like paddy. Mm. With white hair came in and smashed up my medicine cabinet. Took a bottle of morphine and some willow bark tablets. Black jacket. She appeared to be in immense pain. I chose not to stop her. Okay. Well. So there might be some dead kids and roads. Oh. Yeah. What, uh, was it Mucha? Yes, I. Yeah, that's Elizabeth heading in East. Um, let's go check in on the medical office. Make sure, uh, Trix is okay. I'm gonna go let the others know. Telegram. I'm gonna go see what that bell is. All right. Oh. 
You all right, Hurst? Um, it, like I said, Maple, um, you need to take a quick nap. So many things. Again. Ah, uh, uh -huh. aye. You need to. You really need to go take a nap, aye. I'm gonna refill my water real quick. Does anybody else need their canteens refilled? Oh, is it this more main chain? More shine. Okay. What is it? More shine. More shine. All right. And where was the the EK one? Uh, Rhodes, wasn't it? Yep, oh, Rhodes. Shit. I feel that like seems... that's the bit of lead. So I'm not feeling well enough to continue patrolling because I'm just my eyes are off. Right. So uh, I'm gonna stay here. I'll watch the tip line and um, if anything comes, I'll uh, send it out to you directly if it seems important. All right, that'll work. So the tip said that they're in roads at the moment, or they went by roads. We're I mean, in roads. How in long ago, possibly, though? Who knows? Mm, okay. I hate these doors. Just, just, just leave them. I'm gonna be going in there anyway. <laughs> Those doors were my bean when I was here earlier. <laughs> Rip saw me get so frustrated. I went out back door instead. Are we still gonna do the thieves landing thing, or do we want to rotate over? Uh, let's go ahead and check while we're here. I guess, unless anybody feels strongly the other way. Okay, so just itemized list a little bit. We heard about Summers. Where did they say that Summers was? Not Summers himself. It was one of the individuals matching description of the same uh, one I saw when they came to the saloon. Uh, apparently uh, walked straight into the medical office and, and was stealing okay. vials. No, it was here in Blackwater. It was here. Oh, it was in Blackwater. That's why we came here. It was multiple times, too. They made multiple trips. <laughs> Um, and then we've got D.E.K. running around that did the bank robbery earlier. Yeah, so they're probably priority at the moment, then. Mm. It's a shame I'm not around when these Lone Summers gang members are about, because I'd probably recognize most of them. Yep. Alright, um... All right, so who are we waiting on? Uh, oh, Maple, I think. Maple. Um, right here. Are we going to? Where's your horse, Wait, Maple? My, ho I'm on my horse. You are. No. Oh, nope. oh. Uh uh. Maybe we need to get Maple? out of Blackwater. You need. What? You need Maybe to... that's it. Do I need to take a hard nap? Did I. You need to take a hard nap. Yeah. And also stable your horse. <laughs> Stupid fucking horse. I, can you take the horse back to the stable and then take your nap? Yeah. All right, so the plan right, is, do we think that we need to check these, or do y'all want to go to roads? Uh, <sighs> if they're frequenting the medical cabinet here, we may be able to catch, catch them later, but... I am not sure. So we're thinking about checking the Thieves' Landing for... The dad and cuts are for Summer's King. Where are you? Summer's, I think, right? Summer's King. I mean, it's not far away. It wouldn't take too long for us to run through there and see if we see anything. But, um, I have a feeling they wouldn't linger out there because isn't that more of like uh, the Catman Gang's hangout? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's where they've sort been of, setting up shop. Yeah. I sort of doubt that Summer's Gang would linger there because I doubt they're on friendly terms. <laughs> And how long ago was the tip about the dead end kids in Rhodes? Do we know? Uh, it was around the time we uh, sent in the tip of leaving for here. Mm. So that's newer. And it didn't say which way they were riding or anything, right? It just said they were in Rhodes? Yeah, just an uh, individual complaining about one playing the fiddle. Hmm. Where would they go? I mean, they have their clubhouse, too. I have Bulger Gleed. Mm -hmm. Clubhouse. 
These are not kids. It's not a clubhouse, they're a gang. I don't know how often they use that anymore, though. Um. Yeah, my best suggestions would probably be that clubhouse that they use, that broken down church or San Denis somewhere. Hello. Hi. Flapjacks. Don't do me like this. No geezers one. Alright, your horse looks like he's treating you right now. What? <laughs> no, it's you're good. Okay. Alright. Oh, did so, horse go to bed? Uh I think she's staying behind and checking the tip line. Aye, uh, she's uh her head's hurting a lot. She's having a hard time keeping up with us. Okay. Hi Lark. Hi. How much room do you have? Uh, room? Uh, I yeah, think she went and needs some, uh, some oh, tonics. In, in your pockets. pockets. Oh. No, I'm not just gonna fucking... Yeah, she wants to join our patrol, Yeah, guys, I'm gonna, just, no. gonna put in my application for the department tomorrow. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, I can, I, can take, I, I can take up, up to three at the moment. Okay. Medical you bullet. can distribute them amongst yourselves uh, once in your time. I've got five. Thank you, Lark. How much can you? Uh, I have. If they come in pairs of three, probably five. I've got two without getting rid of my lantern. Okay. Have fun. Awesome. Thank you, Lark. There should be three for each of you. Yep. Okay. All right. Thank you, Lark. Yep. No worries. Stay Give safe me out there. Give one second. All right. What did we decide we're doing? I have no clue. Um, I, have I, I think that the roads tip is likely more viable. Although we should probably just go to the plane again. Uh, I checked it before I came out. Oh. Anything? Yeah. No, I didn't see anything. Here, Mitchell. Oh, sorry. No, you're okay. I'm just getting them distributed. But yeah, roads is probably going to be the best bet. Um, I mean, even if, if they're even still in the Lemoyne area. My thoughts are probably either Clubhouse or okay. Sandy. I'm going to the stables real quick. I'm fucking. I'm, I'm taking out my box rider. Right, Lewis. This is for you. Thank you. What do these do? Uh, these are those tonics that Lark makes for basically making it so you can run a little longer. Interesting. Never had one of these before. Yeah, never I've never had them either. But I've heard good things. I know Weller uses them sometimes. I know uh, if I'll trust a tonic from anyone, I'll trust it from Lark. <laughs> Not yeah. sure about other sources. Yeah, that's about the only one. I'm not too sure if I'll end up using it. What do you think, Sheriff? The roads, and we'll check out there? Yeah. Okay. Alright. Do we want to send in a tip just updating uh, where we're actually going to be going, or do we want to just head out? Um. We're the only ones on duty. <sighs> I can send yeah. a tip really quickly. Okay, do it All quick. Right. I'm benching flapjacks. Sorry, excuse me.
Is he resting at the, uh, the bench wall? We might have to interview later. We gotta, we gotta go down with that. Uh, take it. Sheriff? Yes? Just make sure we're for this. <laughs> yep. Alright, everybody good? Night. Dead and kids definitely want law to be chasing them. So hopefully, <coughs> hopefully we'll encounter him. I don't want them to kill my new horse though. I will say that if we do get into an altercation with the dead and cats, uh, they've been known for targeting and killing horses. So keep that in mind. We're gonna cross over in the to the right over here. And once we get across, we're gonna go right. Bert is a pro at killing horses, his own included. He better not kill my horse, man. I will DM him about him being a meanie. Going down. I'll make him feel really bad. <laughs> you know when he broke up with Saffron? When when uh, Boyd broke with Saffron? In the middle, he, he DM'd me. You're making this so hard. I feel like I'm really breaking someone's heart. Good! Suffer! Rip is falling behind somehow. I don't know if he made a tire his horse up too much. Is it that? We're gonna take a right onto the tracks over here. Thanks, Thanks Kyle. Kyle. Wow. He's pretty dirty. Uh, sometimes horses don't recover as well when they're uh, not clean. Have you uh, have you fed him? Yeah, I gave him uh, two carrots. Ember the emotional terrorist. Look, only when provoked, okay? Yeah, let's make sure. 
sure they're not still on roads. And she can make a bloody hood feel bad, she's doing it right. Listen, he didn't feel bad, I see, only OOC. Bert's deserved what he got! <laughs> Aw. Yeah, he kind of did. He's the one who chose to pursue that storyline, okay? It's his fault. <laughs> Reap the consequences! <laughs> Who that was? Uh, no. When we get into roads, do we want to send a couple to the telegram just to see if anybody's in there? Well, how about we all go there? They like to hang out at telegram stations. Telegram station's the closest thing they got to Internet Cafe. I know Wallaby's got a half red like that. Howdy. Did you, see Did you see anything? Did you see anything? Um, uh, the, my, I have my theory, but it's just a theory. Why don't you go ahead and tell me which theory Well, is. there's been a fucking decrepit ancient old woman dressed like a funny fairy tale witch demanding blood of people, and I done heard he got his, his, his big old blood rope split, and we saw that woman in town about 30 minutes before we started hearing he was dead. And uh, can you describe her to me other than which lady? She looks like a fucking fairy tale yeah. witch and she has bright red yeah. eyes that fucking yeah, glow in the dark. Like. We know who it is, okay. Sheriff. Her name's right. Faye. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, we, we were just I told got, that they brought no the body evidence, over here. No nothing, just that's my, that's my theory. And some, some lady named Peach really wanted to see the body. Peach? Peaches? Yeah. Mm. You should have your she wanted to see his body? Forward. Where, where is his body? Yeah, she was pretty Calm broken up down. about it. Like, she just lost, like, the love of her life, and then uh, she oh, learned about that, so I guess they were friends or something. I don't know. Okay. And what was your name, sir? Wait, one. Uh, uh, Jimmy and Julian. I'm Jimmy, that's Julian. Yep. All right, nice to meet ya. Uh-huh. We get out of work. Okay. I like Seriously. your horse. Your horse is nice and black. I like so, do, it. so you're just it's not shiny. telling me where he is? Do you not nice. know where he is? Um, we don't. The body has been moved, so we're not the, sure where. The body has been moved. Like the local the locals, undertakers took him. The locals him. undertakers took him. So I'm not sure where they would have transported him. Um, but if there's any more information, obviously, that you hear or that you can give us, we would appreciate that. I mean, that's just my theory. I ain't got no yeah, evidence I, to it. I get it, but, you know, if you hear know anything... As much as pretty much Maple knew, because he, he came in to the medical office to try to save his life, too. I would tend to someone who got run over by a horse. Y'all hadn't seen any big groups of people besides us in town, have you? Nope. How long y'all been here? Ten minutes. Uh, we, yeah, we literally Ten minutes just got here. We should probably check the tip lane and then maybe the parlor house, see if anyone's yeah. there. Mm -hmm. And then on the St. Denis. Hi. Thank you, Jimmy. Huh. 
grab you. Sorry, the gold on the way. Yeah, it's the same same horse so I'm riding. Nothing, just a rolling tap. Oh. Nothing on the tap. <laughs> Alright. Not wearing shirts. Who is this? Rode by quickly. Hang on. Yep. Ah. Ooh. That's them. That's them. That's them. That's them. Let's go. Keep them inside. Wallaby? Wallaby, Patty, Goldie? Okay, go, 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 go. Come on, Wallaby. Let's stop the horses. Stop the horses. horse has a lot more stamina than mine. So, uh... Come on, Wallaby! Why? Wallaby, you're breaking a lot. We've already had this conversation. <laughs> no. Look, I don't even arrest you that much. I'm too slow. Wallaby. Oh. I just got juked. He was right here, but my horse is getting tired. Yeah, man is. He's got one of those half reds, they just go forever. They all scattered in these little rooms when you just came from over there where that camp is. Night. That's uh -oh. okay. That's Wallaby right there. On, Wallaby, what are you doing? I'm making sure you got my, I got your attention because you lost me, you big bozos. Come on. You just want us to chase you? You're I'm not gonna lose you two times in one chase. It's a new first. Come on. I see. Well, why don't you just pull the horse over before I shoot it? No, do not shoot my horse. Well, you you oh, Wallaby, please don't make her shoot your horse. Come on, 
hope he crashes the horse such a cheeky kid. Yeah. Yeah, that half bread is... There's a reason he's using it. I wish there was more I could do, but I can't. Yeah, is a dead end. Yeah, so I understand. How is that horse running like that? Uh, as a, it's a Hungarian half bred, they've got incredible stamina. They're not the fastest, but they'll outpace any other horse out there. From sh sheer willpower. I'm gonna go around to the right. Wallaby, stop! Is he gonna... He is. Oh! Wallaby! Oh God, it's <laughs> <laughs> Wallaby, that was probably not the wisest decision! Oh, there's lots of gears! Wallaby? Nope! Don't you try and rip me off my horse! Wallaby, stop! What are you doing, Wallaby? Come on! Oh, I'm sorry! I'm not trying to hit you! Ow! Okay, stop running! Get, wait, get off the horse! Oh! There we go! Wallaby, stop! Stop! Wallaby, stop! Don't shoot my I'm gonna shoot that horse. Horse. He's not gonna stop. No, he's not gonna stop. Shoot the horse. <sighs> Wallaby, I'm gonna have to shoot your horse! In three, two, one, we're gonna shoot the horse. Wallaby, stop! Wallaby? Wallaby? Stop! I'm gonna come in, I got a gun! I got a gun! Okay. Let's go get turned. Sorry, I didn't hear what you said. What? We're negotiating terms. Okay, and what are those terms, Wallaby? Wallaby? Alright, what am I facing? Uh, I'll be very honest, I'm not sure. Bank robbery, clean and illusion, two times up. Alright. You can work about this. Okay, so. Can you can you cut me because I'm gonna deal the turnover? Without violence? If you kill me willingly, you don't want such time off. Aye, we're not. I mean, you have any shot at us yet today. That's so, right. That's a, that's a good thing, Wallaby. I like that, I like that, okay. <laughs> what kind of reduction we're looking at, Sheriff? Well, I don't know what that is all added up. I just know the charges, so I can't tell you it's like an exact reduction right now. Y you know how that is, Willoughby. That's always the case. But you know that I'm going to work with you, and I'm going to give you a decent reduction. I've always okay. worked with you in the past before, Willoughby. You know that. Have I ever lied to you? I'm trying to think. Okay. 
Mm. No, I don't want to just time up. I don't know. You, you're kind of in a pithy mood all the time lately. Maybe you've changed. Wait, are you talking about me? No, I'm talking about Louis. Well, he's talking to me. Wait, I'm in grumpy. A I'm in a pissy mood because of something else, not because of anything worse hey, done. Hey, Seth, I see you creeping out out there. I'm not creeping. Stop I'm it. just making sure that you're not trying to sneak yeah, away I while we're I, talking. I saw your shadow creeping by the window. I'm I'm literally walking around outside the building. All right, all right. Okay, if you can offer me a reduction, I'll, hurt, I'll hand myself over. Of course I'm going to offer you a reduction. All right, I want my I want my cattleman that I've got on me. I want to return to me in one piece. Okay, well you have any shot at us, so I don't care. But that's up to the sheriff. Do you have any other weapons on you? Do you have hearse gun that you stole? I do have hearse gun. I stole yes. Can I have that one? Back <laughs> and you can keep it. <laughs> yeah, we can do that. That's, that's like a deal. Yeah, reduction, yeah, okay. reduction, and you keep your cattleman, and we keep hearse gun. All right, let me think about this for a moment in my head. Okay. <laughs> I'm not coming in, I'm just moving. Hey, right, there's just the one door on that side, correct? Sheriff? Two doors, yeah. Okay, but you can see them both. Uh, also, I also yeah. want you to, okay, to make this an actual deal, and I'll come out right now with my hands up, there's one more thing. What is it? I wanted to hear you verbally say that if I didn't shoot up in the air, I would have got away. Well, yeah, if you hadn't shot up in the air, I had no idea where you were. I got okay. away. Alright, that's right. So I outsmarted you. I just got too cocky. You, you got very cocky. Aye. Alright, I'm coming out with my hands up. I'm not ever going to deny the truth, Wally. Thank I'm you, here. sir. Alright. They got me. By the way, can I just mm -hmm. say, your horse stamina management was fucking great. i got to give it to you. It was, Go it ahead was and cuff him, very you. difficult. Can you turn away from me, Wallaby, please? Go yes, ahead and stare at me, Wallaby. There you go. Appreciate you turning yourself in. We might need to take a wee bit of a nap. Oh, me? Let me. Well, let me try again. Ah, uh, my cuffs are breaking. Ah, uh, you need yeah, to take a nap. Yeah, okay. Of okay, give, give me a second. Just a really quick one. We'll take him to San Denis, probably. Eh? Mm -hmm. That's what I'm thinking. We need to get a telegram out so that others know where we are because they're probably worried. And they might have cut one or two of the others. I think he's technically got unlawful discharge as well, but I'll just drop that. He was pretty far outside time. Yeah. No, I'm talking about from earlier. Oh, okay. I don't know what is going on with these cuffs. Oh, fuck you. What are you doing? What are you, what are you doing? <laughs> it could be a <laughs> me problem at this point. Uh, I'm not going to see just, if you can just... get on the horse. Um, I'm completely okay. All right. <laughs> <sighs> Poor Calixto. I know that was a hard one, wasn't it, boy? Uh, see if you can hop up. Ah. Uh... Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I don't follow you, Mitchell. I uh, think you were a wee bit unlucky. You had one of the uh, better horsemen of the department and a sheriff oh, with a lot of yeah, experience. Yeah, yeah, all right. Yeah, all right. I lost you in that little shrub, okay? Don't be bragging. Oh, I, I mean, my horse, I was running my horse from the other side of town when you were still relaxing your way out. Yeah, I still lost you in the shrubbery. <laughs> okay. So competitive. Don't be bragging. I was, I mean, I was, I was commanding your ability to almost slip away. And to get away Almost with. slip away. Oh, give me I a mean, break. I did slip. Hi. Sorry, right here. <laughs> I didn't think that you lost us twice in one chase, though. I came close. Maybe. I, c I 
could have shot back. I could have. You could have. And appreciate that you didn't. I didn't even want to have to pull that trigger, but. <laughs> mm hmm. Alright. Oh, the cuffs are looking better. I've been already. a bad boy. <laughs> when are you not, Lolly? <laughs> this is true. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Are you good if I go send an update? Uh, I. Yeah, you didn't catch right. my friends, did you? Uh, not no sure. idea. All right, uh, I'm gonna put some stuff in the corner and then I'm gonna search you. Coffee for a moment. <laughs> you can't, right? Nope. Um, I think we should both have a really hard nap. We should probably both take a really hard nap, right? Um, all right. Gonna take your word. You're not gonna. Right. Wallaby laugh kills me. It's a little bit disturbing now. It's changed. You got shot Back here in a moment. Welcome to day one. Rob, thank you to follow. Ah, that's incredibly aggravating. How is okay? I'll try quitting again.
<sighs> this is very upsetting. That's so maddening. Who's here in town? Why is sand need garbage? <laughs> and it usually doesn't really help. Usually the hard relog is the best and only way. It might not even let me spawn a horse. My horse is instantly bubbled away. I think the three biggest streamers on the server now mostly hang out in San Denis, so that kind of makes sense. Ah, I see. me describing my inner frustrations. Hey, maybe I'm back because my horse is here. Something I couldn't see right there. There's a horse there. You crashed right into it. No, I don't see a horse. Oh shit! You okay? <laughs> Well, I just charged him, so. Okay. Right. I gave him uh, 10 days time served and then knocked another 50 off for compliance. Okay. So he's just going to sit here in the cell and serve his 90 days. And he wanted his fine to be rounded up to $700, so uh, he took a heavier fine. Okay. Yep. Are you trying to get to a certain amount or to the state or something? How did you know? I mean, that's pretty much <laughs> the only thing that I could possibly imagine if you're wanting more of a fame. You want I'm almost cloud. getting to the big 50. How far away are you? 
few thousand. I'm at like 46 at the moment. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I don't think there's anyone who has much money as I do. I don't know. I, 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 I don't know Ken too. Sorry, guys, had to have a conversation.
I wanted him to hurt the way that I hurt when he smashed my face in. Are you talking about Kelm? No. Edwin. How'd you put him in harm's way? I wanted him to feel alone like I did. So I ruined his friendship with people. He'd be still alive if it wasn't for me. It's because I fixed someone like a tank. You might as well say that I murdered him. I might as well have. That's not what I wanted. I wanted him to come back. I, I wanted him to come back. I didn't want him to die. It was never about that. I just wanted him to be scared like I was. But I went too far. He wasn't meant to die. <laughs> he wasn't meant to die. You don't know who killed him? I don't know what happened. I just know that he got hurt and he didn't get back up. I wish, I wish. That it was me that died. I should have died. But you didn't. You're still here. <laughs> Part of me is... I don't think I could take bearing another friend. I don't think I could bear it. It's not an easy thing to do. I've buried quite a few myself. Three out of the seven dead end kids are gone. LJ's off to war. He'll probably be the fourth. You miss it, Chrissy. Right. That's all that's left at the moment. You got that new guy running around with you. It's not the same. It's one of the hardest things to accept about life, Wallaby, is that things change. Nothing's ever going to remain the same forever. That's right. Maybe I've got to do some changing. <laughs> or just adapting. Or maybe picking, maybe picking a path that doesn't take you towards the same pain <laughs> as the one that you're on. Yeah, you said so yourself. Right, you've all had to bury your friends and you've picked a good path now. Seems to me good and bad path. It's just full of pain. Life is full of pain, Wallaby. Yes, it is. It doesn't mean that we can't work to avert it, to avoid it. I've tried to avoid it. I sure have. I but I've only seen you try one way since you've been in the state.
You're right. Maybe it's time I start trying a different way. <laughs> yeah. Maybe it's time. And what do you mean when you're saying different way, Willoughby? Is it going to be a way that continues to waste your potential? That continues oh. to throw yourself and your friends in the path of danger? You think I've wasted my potential? I do. I'm the best at what I do, Saffron Mitchell. Willoughby, any time someone is hanging out behind these bars, any time I'm having to put someone behind these bars, it's because they are wasting their potential. They are taking gifts that they could use to do good things and use them for bad things. What could I do? Maybe be a baker? Maybe, maybe work in the butcher shop and make some sausages? No, no, no. That's not the only sort of things available in life. There's no, explorers it's all about and the adventurers and all sorts of stories. Adventurers. Well, be I had to live a fast life too. And that's one of the reasons why I went towards picking up a badge. Because mm. at least I could do something to help stop some of the pain in this world. Instead of causing it. Do you think putting me here is stopping pain in the world? Well, the only thing that we can do to help you realise the consequences of your actions is to stop you when we can. I'm headed down to send a telegram, I'll be back. Alright. Consequences for my actions. Aye. <laughs> if I never received consequences for my actions, I would have never pulled myself out of the hole that I slipped down into and dug for myself. Maybe I like the hole. Did you think about that? I think that's a lie that you tell yourself. <laughs> no. See, I'm all about leaving my footprint behind. I'm under no illusion that I'm not going to make it out of my 20s. But I'll be remembered. Will they remember you? I don't know, and I don't care. <laughs> Maybe that's the difference. No. My name will live on forever. That's what it's about. We're here for such a short amount of time. All the people remembered dying young. I believe in the deepest of prints. Well, if that's all that you care about, Willoughby, there's not too much I can now see or do, unfortunately. I appreciate you trying. Well, I really do. You want to save me, Saffron Mitchell? <laughs> Billy the Kid. Jesse James. Butch Cassidy. The Sundance Kid. I'm from their cloth. Did you read the paper? No, I don't read the paper too much these days. <laughs> Another big old article about me. <laughs> yeah. My big brother, Joey. Used to read me 
the articles, the snippets about everything that happened out here, all the big outlaws, all their escapades, all the excitement. My brother looked up to them. They were his heroes. My brother would be proud of me. I think so. Oh, yes. If he saw the name that I've made for myself out here, he'd be so happy. He'd be smiling from ear to ear. I'm making him proud. Every time I rob a bank. Every time. What about your friends? You care about what them, I? Of course I do. I think maybe you need to ask yourself, though, if these people that you care about would still be alive if you hadn't been following this path to make yourself famous, to make yourself known. to me, Willoughby, that sounds like pain. Yeah, he does. Zephyrin's had serious conversations with him. My brother would be proud of me. And maybe he would. I. I've got to go to Valentine to give her her whipping, and then I've got to go to bed. I should have gone to bed like an hour ago. Okay. Um. We'll, uh, um handle over to Valentine. All right. I mean, he's good to go. So. Aye. His weapon when he comes back for it is in there tagged okay mm -hmm. the other one i've got and i'm taking back to hers okay all right y'all be safe all right safe i didn't know i didn't even know your brother it's possible that he would be proud of you you didn't answer my question. I think you know the answer to it. Howdy. Hey. You got shot. Welcome to day one. That was, uh, that was everything with. Oh, well, we caught him. Like, he's just feeling the weight of some of his actions with people that he's lost. <sighs> it's something I warned him about. And it's brought him to a bad place. I, I can tell you've done your done what you can to try and help him. I just hate watching people throw their lives away. It's everything that I wanted to stop, and that's why I take this job. They fight and they claw you every step of the way. (sighs) 
You can lead a horse to water. It doesn't mean it will drink. I know. It's a choice they have to make. And if they won't choose it, there's nothing we can do for them. Is he in any, uh, any state to talk, or probably best to let him be? Is there something you could ask him about? No, I just wanted to, uh, well, I was thinking maybe just lending an ear. You can talk to him. He keeps laughing in a way, but I think it's... How he's coping with it? Uh, it's a part of the mask. <laughs> it's a mask he's using to tell himself that he's not in pain. Just thinking about how I lost you today. <laughs> you were so slow. Well, it's just a different thing, so you gotta take uh, into account. He's actually put something over his face. <laughs> I can hear it being muffled. Yeah, my best friend Eddie loved that plan. We've been waiting a long time to lose you there. <laughs> well, you may have lost me, but I uh, certainly caught one of your friends. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. If you had came in peacefully, I would have played a little tune. I would have pulled out the guitar. <laughs> Didn't uh, shoot the deputies. Also, we're trying to chase you, Justin. I've never wanted to hurt you. Yeah, you're doesn't. just doing your part in the game. The big game. <laughs> Are they game of life? Yeah. We're all just making our moves, trying to survive. Without you, it wouldn't be nearly as fun. <laughs> I love you guys. Without you, the game wouldn't be worth playing. <laughs> I don't think that's true. Mm, it is. All the planning and the, the running, that's what it's about. Outsmarting you makes me feel so good. <laughs> and you really think that's the, uh, the hand you're dealt? <sighs> The only actions you can take is to plan and run and... I'm the best. Someone's gonna have to be the best at everything, right? 
This is what I was born to do. Have we thought about maybe reshuffling the deck? <laughs> You'd like anyway. that, wouldn't you? You'd love nothing more than to see me stop. I, I would have be. Not that. <laughs> I just wish that you would take off that mask. <laughs> Not the one that you're wearing across your face, but the one that you're always wearing. <laughs> know what it's like to wear masks so that when you look in the mirror you don't see what's really there. Mm. That you don't see what you're hiding from. <sighs> I pushed away a lot of pain. Refusing to acknowledge it. It brought me more pain than I could have imagined. Maybe I don't want to take it off. No, of course you don't. It's like ripping a bandage off of a wound that's festering. As long as it's covered up, you don't have to look at it. Doesn't he mean that's not rotten away and gangrenous on the inside, crawling with maggots? Sometimes you've got to be willing to ask for help. And lots of things, there's a point it's reached where you can't do it without help. You got shot! Welcome to day one! I don't know that these are just words. And there's a point where I have to step back and tell to tell myself that I've done everything that I can regardless of whatever mistakes I might have made. <laughs> In this wonderful brought into town by Mana, she was asking him on the road about helping her to find a vein to inject morphine into. She was shooting when coming to town at a wolf only she could see. While well, I checked for Lark in town, apparently she ran off towards tall trees, talking more nonsense and wanting to find her own doctor. We'll check surrounding area, but cannot do full search. Delusional woman. Coming through an armadillo like she's completely dazed, yelling at everyone to stop staring at her. She keeps staring at nothing. Shot down the road at nothing, too. Something's wrong with Tibbet. I wonder if someone, like, did some weird drugging thing. I always have faith. I don't believe a man who created life would create someone to cause pain not to themselves, not to others <sighs> don't let your past define your future there's not a person on this planet who can change the past? But we've all got the power to change the future. Maybe it takes a guiding hand or a stern conversation. At the end of it, only you can take that choice. Make that choice to take that path.
You couldn't move the dove to another room when you're RP, Wolf. We all make mistakes. <laughs> can't RP with Onyx because she'll scream and whis wolf whistle. And personally speaking, I'm stubborn enough to hide away from pain. Maybe it's not the right thing to do. But you are your own person, you learn how to deal with things. Maybe not in the right manner. No one can fault you. I just hope you know that uh, you're not alone in this world. And if you want that help, you can get it. Without a doubt. steel blue with gray things in the color yeah oh tricked out cattlemen's are gorgeous Oh yeah, no, there's a lot of fantastic people on the server. <laughs> I figured you meant that. It's easy to see why you want this Kalman back. Did uh, someone make that for you? <laughs> I guess you could say that. Well, I don't know. It's nice, right? Really? Does it always admire the cattlemen when they're done up? Mm hmm. <laughs> it's very nice and cravings. Cattleman's gonna be worth something one day. So you're hoping. No doubt it will be. <laughs> Someone's gonna wanna have the wallaby kids gone. <laughs> I need to see the Ember was amazing to watch and like normally you hit me with feels. 
I hit myself with the feels. Why am I being tagged in Vert's meta chat? I can't look at that while I'm in the game. What was, uh, what was the sentence in the end? I think you got a total of 90 days. Sorry, did you hear me? And he's, uh, he's getting his things back as well. Hi. This. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> How are you doing? I'm fine. <laughs> what? That's my line. No, it's definitely my line. No, I've been saying that for... Everyone, go spam the I'm fine emote in his chat, please. Go over there. So have I. <laughs> yeah. I found something out earlier. What's that? Maybe I should uh, send it in a telegram. Again to what you did for me. Wait, what? Uh, you know the, uh, telegram you sent me? Beware. <laughs> I? Yeah, I got something right for you. I don't know if beware would, would fit it, but... Wait, is there someone coming for me? Yeah, you've apparently piqued somebody's interest. Is it Sam Bass? No. Is it Billy Blasters? No. Is Henrietta behind it? No. Although I admit that would be pretty interesting to see if she tried to hit you up with ad. Why do you want only tell me in the telegram? <laughs> oh, I just feel like it'd be, you know, be poetic. Have you already sent this telegram? No. Okay, I want to uh, know now. I would have told you in person. <laughs> Listen, I would have told you in person had you been anywhere near me and I couldn't even, so uh. I said you do weird. <laughs> Well, uh, I'm not going to reveal who uh, who told me this, but apparently uh, you've piqued the interest of a little old Buckley. Oh, Buckley. No. I don't want to break his heart. Oh... Yeah. He's very, very young. <sighs> no, I, uh, huh? I thought he uh, was going after Briar. <laughs> I, f I feel like Briar's a bit too old for him too. <laughs> you reckon he's shooting up the ladder? <sighs> no, I, what? No, I just think that he's very naive. No, I mean, uh, not... Uh, <laughs> Probably bad choice of words on that one. Um, I'm shooting up the ladder in terms of like he's, you know, one age and he's I, I'm, I'm trying to... I have no idea. I don't know what age he actually is. I just know how he acts. He just, right. you know, he's a wee bab. Yeah, I, uh... I mean, I'm, I'm 29. Pretty sure that he's barely 20. Uh, uh, maybe 22. Maybe. Uh, I can't even tell you how many times. <laughs> Literally one time, he wouldn't he stop standing this close to me. So I kept moving to the other side <laughs> of the porch. And every time I moved away from him, he'd come and he'd stand right next to me again. <laughs> 
I probably did that five or six times before I walked towards the general store in Strawberry and he started following me so as soon as I got around the corner from him I bolted away. I bolted. <laughs> I went and I stood another part of town for a wee bit. I was always losing my mind. I if, couldn't handle it anymore. If that didn't break his heart, I don't think you can. <sighs> well, he's a sweet kid. He really is. It's just I don't want to be unkind. <laughs> He's a sweet kid. But in my view, he is that. He's a kid. Yeah, it kind of reminds me of like Ned or, or such. Is this something that he revealed to you? Oh no, he didn't re reveal it to me. Someone else did. Yeah, I'm on secondhand information. I got told about it and I was like, huh, maybe I could send a telegram with the <laughs> <laughs> I feel, feel maybe we're in the same boat. Oh no, it's 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 good to know that way I can make sure I'm not accidentally encouraging it or something like that. Mm -hmm. Don't wanna don't wanna hurt him. It's hard to be interested in someone romantically who feels a kid and or childish. Yeah. Okay. Ah. Uh. We probably. We probably need to go to Valentine. Yeah, uh, something happened. There is stuff happening. Um, Wallaby. How much time are the guards saying you've got left? Uh, 47. Right. I can wait here, it's okay, Fine. you can go. Um, your gun is tagged in storage here. Um, mm -hmm. So you'll have to come back here to get it. That's fine. Okay. Uh, Thorn and everyone should be on their way back here. Sorry about that. Okay, so... Are you thinking of giving him, giving him his uh, stuff, stuff back here in the back? Uh, we'll, we'll have to give it back to him uh, when he, he gets out. Um, because he's still got he's got still got some time in here. Maple and Thorn should be coming back to the office here. They said they would, uh, but they might not if it's if the dust is bad here. Right. We Let's. Uh, uh huh. We need to just probably just go to Valentine. If we don't see them out there, let's ride towards the telegram station. Because the dust was bad here in time. Gotcha. Yeah, you may need to, uh, Sorry? a new saddle. Sorry? I need a new saddle? Yeah. Okay. And of course. Oh, oh, oh good. There you all are. Let's all go to Valentine. Oh, okay. I'm gonna uh, try flapjacks back in. Alright, there's a there's reports of six armed raiders in Valentine shooting up in the air and stuff. And Hurst is going to, to Armadillo alone, because apparently uh Tibba is very delusional and uh there, there's just a lot of stuff going on. Okay. Pardon me. Yeah, I can't wait to see Buckley get his heart broken. Will be nice to see Saf be the heartbreaker for once. Oh, guys, she doesn't want to break someone's heart. Love 
love targeting. Sorry, did someone say something? No, it's, I think it's the other riders that are now tagging along with us. Okay. Alright, let's speed up here. Taking it up, Thorn. Is that Babs? Who is that? That voice is so familiar. I believe they said, no, I've already had two nitro cold brews today, Tiramisu. I don't need any more coffee. Okay, slowing down. Is everyone okay? What's going on? Slowing it down. Um, I think my horse needs a little bit. Hi. We can, uh... How's your horse doing, Rip? Uh, he needs a little rest. Okay. Well, we're gonna continue straight here. Lewis had to go to bed, so I think that we are the only ones around. Alright, are we Were good? Were there any go. descriptions of the writers? Nope. Yeah. Alright, picking it up. Okay, you good to pick it up, Rip? Dave, thank you for the follow. All right, resting. Resting. Taking the left. Taking the left off road. Stop as many I want in the <laughs> Yeah, that is one place I cannot relate to Saffron. <sighs> I'm all set. Is everyone good to return to faster speed? Good. Yep. All good. All right, picking it up. Picking it up. Continue in northwest. Continue in northwest. Oh, watch the cliff. Sorry, rep. <laughs> My apologies. I should have veered more to the sharp drop. Last. I know. I know. a lot more than that to put us down. I'm sorry. Oh, my head. Okay. I'll slow up. Slow down. <laughs> rip, rip, source.
right, picking it back up. Yeah, we, we say that to people. Um, we say that, you know, if something's wrong with their tack or they need to get a new saddle or something like that, when we just mean that they need to go respawn their horse uh, because it's decoupled for them or something. And so we see it as an NPC horse and it makes our horses auto travel alongside them and try, and it makes you see the option to jump onto their horse. It makes it really hard to ride in formation because it causes the horses to autopilot themselves and automatically speed up and slow down for the other horses. See if there's. Oh, see if it's here in time. Uh, Heidi heard reports of there being gunshots being fired in time. Yeah, there was a group of people coming in, Red Hood people. There were four of them. They all had the red mask and they, they came, they rode through town on their horse one by one. They, they came in uh, that way. Uh, uh -huh. from the church and then they rode through town they all shooting in the air and then they just rode out that way towards strawberry they're gone they rode out towards they strawberry they ain't stop and they were shooting in the air but there was them red hood gang all right thank you is it the red so, hood uh, the bloody hood uh, that's what summers no it's not summers um <laughs> speedy said speedy chased me out of town thinking i was chasing them down by myself i said no i'm just watching where they're going but, of course, I had lost them by that point because I was already way down at the telegram office when they started the shooting. But uh, Speedy said he thought it may have been the Red Hood gang. Fine, so. That's what, um, that's what Straight just said, too. Yeah, so... And there was four um, of them last night. So, and yeah, there's there six of them now. Six oh, no, there was, there was some doubled up on horses tonight. There was way more than four. They had three so, red masks um, and one yellow masked new blood yeah. last night. I saw a yellow mask. I also think I saw somebody wearing blue. They might be, um, be new bloods. Yeah. So there were five, I think six though. Um, but anyways, I've been trying to go to bed for about Fine. an hour and a half now. So should we continue down to Armadillo to support Hearst and just try and respond well, to these? If we Hearst just said that Tibbet is no longer there and she's okay. returning. Um, you can read the tip if you want, but she's okay. basically Tibbet was no longer there and she's put out a range of bulletin okay. to keep an eye out for, her, but also let them know that she's dangerous. So, but as of now, we don't know where she is. All right, Tibbet's dangerous. She's hallucinating. She was she was right delusional now. apparently. She's delusional and shooting randomly. Oh. Okay. Yeah. You might want to go read the tips. Um, the doctors, yeah. I think, think she's got an infection or something. She was firing off shots in Blackwater and then ran out of town, and then she was an armadillo. Hearst has been chasing all over the west trying to get her. <laughs> but uh, y'all just be careful with this bloody hood gang. They're obviously trying to pull people out. Oh, great. Right, and they are... <laughs> Lewis, go to bed. They might be looking for me. They what is it? Said as much. That's Elizabeth Moonshine. All right, I'm going east. to bed. You rest up. Just be careful, please. Hi. All right, Hearst's going to Blackwater. Let's head that way so we can hopefully meet her. Yeah. I don't want her to get caught out alone by these people. Uh, we're going to head out to Blackwater. Because Hurst is a uh, Hurst is oh. Hurst is going that way. I'll go ahead. I'll send the tip, and we'll meet you. Aye, aye. Uh, who's walking into the sheriff's office? He's demonstrating that the door is locked but open. Appreciate you helping move the door. Hello. <laughs> what are you doing? Come in. Well, the door is wide open, so I just walk through it. Should be locked. That's Kelly. Oh, 
Um, if we see these people, I'm gonna recommend a wind warning and we fire. If we think that we've, if we're caught out in the open. Right. You know, if Hopefully they're, if they're we can. Uh... Guys too, eh? What? Keep distance from these guys. Don't they like tackling? Aye, aye. They yeah. they like to tackle, so keep distance. Um. I just keep shooting. I'm not sure if you read the reports last night. They they caught me. Um. They were very happy to have me because they wanted revenge <sighs> for that right, shootout ready? in Thieves' Landing. I. Oh, we'll get him for targeted. I, but I Shock really don't button. care what they get charged for. I'm going down this way. They get charged for, you know, if I'm dead. Their words were, they sold me to Sam Bass and they said, well, it's fine, we're making money now, we'll find her again later. Alright. That is five heads stuff there, Carsis. also threatened everybody at uh, Cisco, so. Wait, who threatened everyone at Cisco? They're not happy. Did I Jack literally threaten me and Cisco? He threatened you and Cisco. When you went to go pick him up? Uh, when we were processing someone else. Um, picking it up. Lovely group of individuals, aren't they? Aye. Ryder! Ryder. I have no doubt that they'd like to do to me and probably to Thorn to whatever the same that they did to Winters. I'm slowing down. Just dodge those grabs. Is it just me or do criminals tend to threaten female deputies more than males? Uh, yeah, because the males just macho it, the females might are more likely to show actual fear, and it's uh, it's more rewarding to RP with. What? Uh, you okay? Hi. Off road. Friend. Mind the rocks to the left. Right, speed it up. I think females also draw less often so they know they can RP threaten longer versus just pulling the shoot. Yeah, it's it's just because of the natural different dispositions. Oh, mind the cliff. Sorry everyone. Got a wee bit mixed up in the fog and train Thorin's uh, alternate route there. I'm blaming on Thorin. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know. I said, well, I was trying your thing with, uh, you know, going not under the bridge there, is what I mean. A little messed up, but okay. I mean, I don't think it's necessarily an intended, you know, thing. It just ends up being, I like to RP with this kind of element. Ah, uh, where's Maple? He's falling behind. Okay. Just want to make sure we're all together and no one got uh, branched or anything. I'll send a tip that we have a ride. All right. Uh, Riley, would you go with her, please? I know that seemed weirdly unbalanced. Okay, it looks like Hurst is here. At least that's her horse out here. Oh, puppy, please. Puppy, get out of we.
Oh my goodness. You good? Hi. Uh, uh. Just gonna take yep. care of some things up here. I've been driven mad trying to figure out what the hell that sound is. Don't worry about it. Yeah, I'll take care of it. Good. I don't know what you think you Hello. saw. I don't know what you think you saw. I'm not sure what I saw. Don't, don't worry about it. Leave my deer alone. My 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 antelope. Leave him alone. <laughs> I need you to. Yep, I'm, I'm not touching him. I hear ropes. Uh, deer on the roof. Ropes. The deer on the roof? Don't worry about it. Don't come up yep. here. Yep. That doesn't make it sound any better, Mitchell. <laughs> Don't mess up my deer. I had the same idea. <laughs> you don't mind throwing down the oh. Yeah, but, ow. Here. Hi. I'm right here. Anthony new on the tip lane. You want a deer? That's yes. my deer. It's my antelope. Don't drop it on my head! Here, I'll deal with these. Don't worry about it. Uh, apparently, Tibbet's, Tibbet might be here. She might be uh, here. Medical office. Okay. Medical office. All right. All right. Uh, Hurst is also apparently here somewhere. I'm yep, sure. Here, as to we okay. She was inside. I thought. No. I didn't see her inside. Yeah. I believe she, she went to the uh, medical oh, office. Oh, there she is, right now. She's here. Listen. Okay. It's not good RP not to be able to move the antelope, okay? It's good RP to not be Aww, able to move cute. large people. Been all over the fucking place tonight. Yeah, man. Yeah. Give everyone up some uh, good food. Uh, aye. Do you need you need any food? I'm gonna go cook it. Food. I uh, wouldn't mind some. All right, I'll ask the others. All right. Do you want a good stack of fresh pronghorn rations? Maple. If you don't like my cooking, you can just say no. Fine, I'm gonna kick for you. Oh my goodness, this storm is horrible. I don't think I want to go 
Do I want to use my time up on everyone? Oh my goodness, can you imagine? Please, I please no. Please no. That's what you you jerks are hoping for. You go, it's content! We like content. Saffron kidnapping bingo. I was I was overweight. But the meat is lighter when after you cook it. I think you and Aurora have a kidnapping contest. I would love to have some of your pronghorn <gasps> rations. Okay. <laughs> all right. Good. Are uh, you all so, happy having a cadet right along with us? Of course. Oh, I. Yeah, Thatcher, I think it was his name. And that's kicked with time, which is hard to gap come by, so you'd be very great over those. Thank you. Here. I've been waiting for some good fuck today. Damn good food. I've been eating Shanna. beef all day. You've been what? I've been eating canned beef all day. Oh, wow. Corned beef is very good stuff. Nothing to sneeze at. Ain't compared to this. Compliments to the chef. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Oh, ah! Excuse me. Great. I first. Can you see me now? I don't think you've been seeing me this entire time. Oh, I can see, oh, uh, see you now. No, okay. The medical office That's unless good. they brought her in just now. She's in there. Well, now I might be yeah, her, but they she just, wasn't here earlier. They just found Tibbet, yeah. Where was she? Apparently out in Tumbleweed. All right, I'm going to go back to the office. You guys can handle this. Uh, we apparently have the bloody heads riding around in force. Six of them. Oh, they were just here, by they, the way. They were just here. Out in the heartlands, they stopped me when I was bringing Tibbet in, but I, they let me go because I told them I went down the back of my horse. But they were just in the heartlands. Okay. Well, not the heartlands, whatever this place. That great plains. plains. They were just outside. Great. Yeah, they were. Just, they shot five shots and ran out west I, or north, like okay. I don't know that that way. Well, hopefully they'll yeah. stay out there then. So I just I I, I slipped my mind when I was bringing Tibbet in and I forgot to tell. Her no, spot. it's okay. Don't worry. <sighs> Just my luck to get stopped by them on the way in, isn't it? Oh, they let you go, mm. so that's that's a good thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I guess. Rip, will you come with me? I need to check my telegrams. Oops. All right. Not fall off my horse. I guess I can send you the beware. Sorry. Never oh, mind. I, I, no, sorry, I'm, I'm just, I'm thinking about the... No, 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 you're, you're good. The current threats. <laughs> oh, look, on the stable. What? More, uh... <laughs> oh, my goodness. I think the only way up there is to get a wagon and climb up on top. Uh, Yekka does. Is it two two one? Yeah, yeah, could two two one. You guys can give her a shout out. <laughs> I don't think that we should split up uh, right no. now. With that group out. And force. Oh, I agree. 
I don't think that it'd be a good idea for us to go train to hunt them. Not with the numbers that we have mm -hmm. currently. No. If we hear them doing something, then I will respond, but... seen in the heartlands so uh no out here in the plains is what he meant oh correct sorry no it's all right oh wow hello need in black water okay mm -hmm. all right yep we're caught up for the moment finally and now we breathe don't you dare, don't you dare say that i said breathe we breathe i also thought you said breathe for a minute what and, the fuck? Uh, <laughs> was about to uh have many other comments <laughs> what the fuck uh need any rations first i just uh, did a bunch breath. of pronghorn on the roof and they are now delicious steaks time quite delicious highly recommend yeah i guess y'all really didn't hear me i was asking how many deputies does it take to get corpses off the roof but... <laughs> <laughs> no i didn't hear you. okay <laughs> that's why i kept because all i saw was three people up there and then i saw you fall off i don't know what you're talking about <laughs> Oh, I did not I get thrown off the roof by a pronghorn. Yeah, that's definitely <laughs> not what I witnessed. <laughs> you got thrown off the roof by a pronghorn? No, you... No. Hearst and Kavanaugh think that they see things when I'm on roofs, and it's just, you know, it's dusty mm. and black water. Mm. Mm -hmm. ah! It's true. It's true. That was a very tough pronghorn. Very mean one, too. Um... I mean, I think that those pronghorns were perfectly normal pronghorns. Ordinary. Weak, even. Does that make it better or worse? Um, I mean, they did they throw me off the roof, so... Oh, okay. Yeah, I guess it wouldn't make it anyway. Uh, you know. I, it doesn't make it anyway. I need to go buy carrots. Anyway. Mm -hmm. After eight and a half hours of this chaos, just laying anywhere feels real good. Yeah, you don't. Considering how many so of those clear, you gator don't want, You don't want time. You don't need time uh, pronghorn steaks. They're good. <laughs> I think I'm, I'm okay for Okay, them. all right. <laughs> I don't even know how that happened. I like bounced off of stuff and went flying. It was stupid, man. It was dumb! <laughs> oh my goodness. Carsim coming in with five gifted subs. Thank you so much. You guys can get hearts and chat and cute little puppy dogs. Thank you so much, Carson. Or Carson. Probably Carson, like character simulation. Simmer. Are you making more emotes soon? Um, I can see about contacting my artist or the artist who I had make mine. Uh. I'll have to see if they're still making them. The problem is, since I don't have partner, uh, I can't add them to Twitch, really. I could maybe add a couple and just, like, have some be animated only. Oh, Char Sim. Okay, Char Sim. Got it. Yeah, um... But yeah, I think some of my static emotes could probably just, you know, like the bouncing cashew could be the only one. The raid, the shaky rage one could be the only one. Stuff like that. So I could probably purchase some more. I'll just have to look at their packages and see what I could get.
Because we have money set aside for stuff like that from for donos. It's just a, you know, evaluating what I can actually use. But if you guys want to make suggestions in the Discord what kind of emote to get next, if we're talking like ravens and stuff, I'm coming back this way. Yeah, I could probably free up three slots here. Yeah, exactly. How do you kidnap the raven? It'd be nice to see more staff emote slang ones. See, right now I'm maining Saffron really hard, but I don't always just play Saffron. That's why I haven't gotten character specific emotes. I mean, I suppose I could do them where I just use screenshots and stuff. Um, but if you're talking about like the, the character emotes, you know, like the, the little mascot, the little raven. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what people want, so. I know when I went and ch chose my name for the streaming and stuff, p some people were like, oh, you should just be Saffron or something. I'm like, well, yeah, but what if I don't always play Saffron? And it's true, I didn't play Saffron for a long time. And I mean, Saffron could die. Crash emote, binoc emote. <laughs> yeah, but those ones, I mean, the ones that people use the most are the reactionary ones, right? So maybe like a, a popcorn eating one. Ooh, okay. Heidi? Is, uh, is everything okay, sir? Oh, yeah. I, I, don't, I don't think we've met. I'm a cadet Thatcher Mantel. Oh, okay. Heidi. Right. Oh, good to see you. My, good to see you. Oh, I'm good. To... You're welcome inside. You don't have to stand out on the porch. Nothing's going on. I'll say that. I'll hear you. I we know that we've got the hoods out sex deep, but we don't mm -hmm. know where they're doing or what you know what what they're doing. We could try and split, mm -mm. but otherwise, I mean, without anything, you know, right now we can only respond to what we know. Yeah. I just know there's a lot of people in Valentine. Oh, I don't know. Mm. There's really not anybody here. Hasn't really been too many people coming through here, other than the medics. So. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Could be worth heading to Valentine if there's a lot of people there, though. But if they've already been through there, odds are low that they'd go back. I imagine, right? Aye. There was nobody in Armadillo. Um, well, there might have been some people in Tumbleweed, not sure. While we've got a lull, I'm going to take a few minutes to sit down. Yeah, I would Just... I would enjoy it while it lasts. Mm I got my to my lay down. Okay, I'll, I'll pay. 
pass it along. Uh, maple, okay. right? Yes, Maple. Have it's good night. Good to see you again. You too, friend. I'll be sure to let him know. Yep. I should read book too. Yep. Good luck, bud. Thank you. Stay safe. Careful. I'm going to bed. I hate these doors. <laughs> I hear Johnson's missing body. What? <sighs> I'm sorry, missing body. Need Law and Valentine, former Mayor Johnson's body was apparently stolen but has been found. Uh. God, even in death, he's still managing. Do this. Oh, are you, lady? You've stolen me body. You go ahead to take me back. Yeah, you do a really good impression, but it's a little too soon for that. He just passed away. Yeah, imagine how I feel. Okay, uh, we need to get dead. to Valentine. Well, apparently his missing body has been found. Yeah. Um, I guess I'll head to Valentine. Does anybody else want to go to Valentine? I, I could go with you. I could come with you. Okay. If if you think it's better on your own, that's fine too. I don't really know what to expect for this. I've not actually had to deal with the corpse before, so at least in this capacity. I understand. Well, if it's all the same, I, I'll tag along, I suppose. Yeah. Yeah, come on. Riff, are you staying here? Yeah.
too bad shot. Welcome to day one. All right, sorry about the wait, guys. Anything going on? Not that I can see, nope. All right. Oh, uh, the cadet went to Valentine? Mm-hmm. Yeah, with hers. Okay. Um, <coughs> what were the lyrics of the song? Hang on. I look in my files because that because my lyrical folder is a lot uh, smaller than a lot of the others. Uh, 
Uh, was that promises I couldn't keep? Does that sound like something that was said? By Nick- no, Nicholas, roll at row. Uh... It's not a Ben Bostick. Here, I, I can I can play it for a second. Uh. No, that's not it. Hang on. Uh, maybe I broke free. Uh, sorry, Dan. Was saying talk? Uh, sorry, no. No. Anything, uh, anything happen? I don't think so. <laughs> Definitely not it. Alright. Yeah, I'm trying to find Untroubled Mind. Almost home? Maybe that's it. Human's way. Nope. I'm just gonna go through everything. Yeah. Nope. Was it this one? Yeah, this is, um, this is Hope is Nigh by a Mick Cutler. Oh, right before this one? This one? Alright, I'm just gonna need uh, a few minutes. Bye. Uh oh. Oh, right, yeah. I'm used to see hearing this one just the instrumental, so I wasn't thinking about it. Uh, this one, hang on. Yeah, usually when we play this, this is just... This is Dark Space by We2050. Uh, or my also uh, Near Ben Ami. Gonna go down the telegram station. Alrighty. Oh yeah, no, it's nice.
We really better not <coughs> get kids. Yeah, I'm turning it down. <laughs> I I just had it up for uh cuz people wanted to hear it. I have my dogs in here now and uh, they're very happy to be here with me. I love them so much. Okay, over here. It's fine. Uh, Tibet is just going with a couple of friends. Okay. Do but, uh, we have any idea what happened to her? Do we think someone did something to her, or is she just? It looked like an infection from a previous wound. Okay. All right. That's what it looks like. All right. It looked like it had been stitched up and such. Um, I can check the records to see if we did any of that. But uh, right. it looks like it was just an infection from from the wound. Alright, hey, no, I'll trust you on that. I was just curious. I didn't even know if we were having an instance of someone being poisoned or... No. Not from what I saw. Okay. 
All right. Okay. All right. Thanks. Oh, you're welcome, Shitty. Remember when Isabel was hunting down and picking up one? Yeah, no kidding, right? No, she... Ah, uh, yup. Yup. She was fully ready to perma if any of them did. Like, because that was back when if one of them permed, she would have been force executed. Alright, I'm just gonna get this done. Oh, did we hear, were we able to talk to, um, Aurora about Nate Casey? Uh, no. I saw him earlier. Uh, Aurora said he laid his head down in Thebes, but, uh, okay. he was very much around with, uh, the, the other lady and Billy and one other. They were riding in a coach heading towards uh, Rhodes whilst you all were, were trying to apprehend uh, the dead end kids. I'm gonna have to try and question them both. I think. Mm. Hopefully, we can get a statement from me about what happened. Well, it looks like his mouth has been sewed shut, so. Right, we're gonna have to. Or see if he can write. Yeah. Either. It's quite. Hopefully that means that uh, Bloody Hoods have decided to call it a night. Rod and three of them. Yeah, what do you mean? Was there a tip or? I mean, it's quiet. There's, we haven't heard anything for a while. So I'm saying, hopefully, oh, well. that means that they've decided to call it a night. Yeah, never know. Right. Yeah, I've been in Blackwater, and I, I believe they want mostly operate around Strawberry or Rhodes now. I am not sure. But we, I mean, we were hearing reports about them running through towns and shooting up in the air and stuff, is what I mean. And now, hmm. it's, now it's very, very quiet. Apparently, they found Lord Johnson's body. Valentine. Yeah. Well, someone stole it. Apparently. I managed to get it back. You know, he was a nuisance, but I doubt he deserved whatever happened. Not get the music to. How's your uh, how's your back down? Oh, it's burning a feel fair deal. Side of my body sore. Had a kick from the, the horse earlier in Valentine. Uh, no, I was able to mostly dodge. <coughs> How bad that was, you know. Catch with my hands, mm. just hit the ground more than being cut. More of the kick from the bloody hood last night bothering me. Nice and sharp mm. ribs. You didn't rupture any of your uh, stitches, did you? Uh, I 
Lark said something where I'm sure she fixed it up though. Oh, I'm sorry, man. From uh, earlier in Valentine. No, no, no. I said um, I was able to mainly avoid that being more than a bump. Being thrown to the ground is part of it, avoiding being harmed by it. <laughs> better to hit the ground than to face a hit full force. Oh, I'm sure it doesn't help you f sent yourself flying off a roof. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. There was no <laughs> roof I went flying off of. Right. Probably with the deputies. AJ's situation is a whole lot messier may involve a cannibal. The townsfolk suspect Faye, the witch, Speedy and others may have lured her out of town recently unsure, but Chrissy believes they're going to hurt for her. Okay. We do need to get a Valentine. Is there anyone else on time? Uh, Thorn, right up here, thing on the pier. Ready, uh -huh. Alright, Hearst is requesting deputies to Valentine. Apparently, the whole Awkward Johnson death might involve a cannibal, and the townsfolk are looking at like they're gonna lynch someone in the way over it. Great. Okay. I'll send a tip that we're going. Bye. I did my fuzzy girly girl. I did a nice doggy. <gasps> nice doggy. Sorry guys, I have to put up with my sweet talking my puppy, but she's wonderful. <coughs> Let me tie you up. So Yeah, just something to pass the time, right? Uh-huh. Well, you will skill. Hey, we ready to go? All right. All right. I'm not sure. Potentially turn into a whole cannibal situation now. I. Didn't that fellow say earlier that he thought Sharp left uh, Faye? I. And that's what they think that's. They think that Speedy and everyone might have lured her out of town to exact their own justice. Be burning the witch. Yeah, lynching doesn't necessarily mean just a hanging. It's it's a crowd of vigilantes uh, killing someone who they believe is guilty of a crime uh, illegally. But lots of times these outlaws would get caught uh, by the law and people who they'd harmed would know, and like the whole town would get together, overpower the sheriff's office, and kill the outlaws before they had any sort of trial. Slow down. Poor dog. Taking a left here. Saffron had a very nice, peaceful ride with the creepy lady last night. She wasn't asking about her blood all the time at all. 
probably, I'm pretty sure if I'd said, sure, I'll donate blood to you, she probably would have grabbed me. I'll be honest, I gave her lots of uh, opportunity and she didn't take it, so. <laughs> I tried to, tried to play kind of dumb just for her own RP. <laughs> Doctor said my blood is worthless. I mean, it's true. All right, speeding up. Off road. Why is that blinking, man, Kryptonic? It's true, I literally have a, I almost said an email, but I mean a telegram. You know the most about this, so what you need us to do. So, there's two things happening at the moment. Okay. Um, so basically, from what we were told, Awkward Johnson's body had been taken at some point, and there was a message that was left out behind, like the saloon or something. I have it. Uh, the fellow that told me about it took both of the notes down from both the locations, so we have both of those. So one of the notes said that uh, you can find his body basically up at Vaca Station. And the other note was left up there. Um, I tagged it and put it in there. You can read it if you want. But basically, they went up there and they found his heart, a bunch of blood, like a bite out of it, a bunch of other body parts, um, just a mess up there. Supposedly, the person that wrote it by the name of M. Oh. Uh, it's all they, the name that was on it is just an M. And, um,. Person that they're suspecting is Morgana Fee. I'm assuming she's yeah, that would... witch hat lady mm -hmm. who I spoke with last yep. night. Yeah, and so oh, the problem God. is Chrissy just told us because she likes Awkward Johnson, she didn't want to hear about them doing this to somebody just because of being weird. Apparently, Speedy uh, is missing, and supposedly, because he just was missing from around town and a bunch of other people. Supposedly, he might have lured her away on the assumption or, you know, assurance of a date and lured her out of town with about six to eight other people with them. Six uh, to eight other people. I couldn't tell what number he said at the time, but it was somewhere between six to eight people. It's a lot of people that are involved mm -hmm. in this. So I have no idea where they are. This happened just before sending the telegram to you, apparently. She's not sure how long ago, but it's very recent. So they could very well be out there with her or leaving her somewhere by now. Okay. No idea where to look for that, though. So. No, that's the thing. Is unless we hear something, we're chasing yeah. ghosts. Yeah. So I think at the moment, it might be best just to go up and look at what happened there. At Bacchus. Uh, yeah. And then I guess just see if there's anything else indicating around there. Or maybe bloody Hoods in New Austin. Sheriff Rabbit was just robbed by three Bloody Hoods that I knew blood one other and tumbleweed after clocking on shift. Surround me at the Black House. They are riding in New Austin currently. Any respondents, please make yourself known. I'll be remaining in and around Armadillo for the time being. Uh, it rains, of course. Okay, I'll go Jesus. send a tip to let her know mm. that we're all here, but that we are willing to move on whatever word she has. Yeah. Um, it probably uh, won't take too long to go look at the body, so we can maybe 
figure out what we need to do. Um, just don't want it to wash away. Apparently we don't have that much time. Okay, uh, sure. Let's tell her that we're gonna go look at that, mm -hmm. and then we're gonna come back here and see, okay. s look for her instruction. Got it. Tomato, the tomato boys! <laughs> my favorite name for them. The Tomato Boys. <laughs> <coughs> That's better than the Little Red Riding Hoods, which, oh, oh, see, they love the Little Red Riding Hoods. I was told that this morning. <laughs> I didn't make <laughs> I can't remember who came up with that name. Was that, like, coiner or something? I feel like that was a coiner thing. Uh, make sure you uh, clock on, by the way. Oh, am I not? Okay. Uh, what did I miss? Also, I ran to the outhouse. Ah, uh, the bloody heads just robbed Rabbit down in Newaston. Uh, so they have a pump shotgun now. There's a good chance, eh? So I'm letting Rabbit know that we're going to go check out that thing at Bacchus, and then we're going to come right back here and look for uh, their instruction. All right. Let's get Thorin and Hurst. <laughs> Spicy night tonight. I'm glad. I mean, it's a lot better than having nothing to do. All right, are we ready to head out? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Um, let's let's go this way out of town. If you, I mean. If someone else wants to leave, let me know. I'll just... Yeah, if you know the best way there, go ahead. Bye. I don't know that station as well. All right. Yeah, you can pretty much stay down on the right roads uh, until you get to that fork where you can cut to Bacchus to the left. Good ice dragon. I want stuff to happen. Writer. The other thing you mentioned is uh, apparently Chris said that the only people that knew he was the speedy was missing was uh, mm -hmm. Billy, Joe, and Magnolia. And I'm pretty sure I saw the both of them on a wagon. They were just leaving town. They said they were going to go look for somebody, and they mentioned the road. He, he, he left town. Not like missing as in taking, just left town. Yeah, no, 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 no worries. Sorry. Quiet, 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 quiet. It's no longer quiet.
All right, we'll be slowing down as we reach the tracks. Slowing down. Slowing down. And stopping. Stopping. All right. Go ahead and show us where this is so we can document it. Yeah, he mentioned it should be in, in front, front of, the, of door? the door of the platform facing, facing the track. The platform, yeah. No, there's just other people to look at that math, so I prefer that other people do it. Well, um, we catalog it and get whatever evidence we can. I forgot to stop off at a bank. Fuck. How much you carrying around? Uh, it's not cash. Uh, it's I got a stupid guitar on me. Oh. Weighs like a ton of bricks. <laughs> no room to sta strap it to your horse for now. Uh, I could do. It's just a matter of what do I want to risk. Uh, Yeah, that's just, yeah, that should be good. Didn't he know that you played guitar? Um. Yeah. Um. <laughs> They're bulky. That's the, that's the problem. Yeah. Um. Don't really pull it out that, that often. Sorry. Hey. But I pulled the ukulele. I'll really oh, yeah? bring it out. Probably How many there. songs? Ah, oh, few. Sort of hard to remember sometimes. So. <laughs> Gonna play Root Tie. The uh, question is, are you uh, a bit of a singer? Well, singing's not the problem. It's, uh, it's having the song to sing, I think. Be carrying the invisible body over. That horse is gonna kick one of them. I think they're just trying to get the corpse under. Mm. Hey, could I go watch the bloodbath? All right, are we ready to return to town? Yeah, we should be. We'll have to yeah. look into the we rest of it everything. later, but Aye. we have the notes, so Aye, we have we'll everything else. We'll see what the sheriff has to see. Mm. And uh, I, we've got the notes in the body. Yep. All right, back to. Sorry. Yeah, I noticed. What'd she see? There's a pool of vomit. Yeah, nearby. the vomit. There apparently were people that came up here to check after the note. They might have been said to come here. Yeah. So they might have been them. Oh, there goes my appetite. Yeah. Later. 
Uh, let's make sure the doctors are catching up. Don't want to leave them out here. Slow down. Just in case the wolves. Aye. Yeah, definitely coming out. Aye. Yeah, yeah camps slide up to the left. Sometimes they'll uh, hide out there. Mm. Right, going right. Going right. Gonna ride. Cumberland Forest is actually pretty cool. There's some decent camps here that are pretty unseen, too. It's a shame Baca Station doesn't have a telegram. Oh! Oh! I'm not sure what that was. I guess so. Yeah, I think it was in the middle of the road. That was... My horse just came to a stop. They're all still... And, um, what do we what do we do with the body? I mean, do we have the undertakers take it, even though they failed once, or do we lock it in the office? I mean, uh, I I don't know. I think that's as the doctors, maybe. I mean, I don't know. I'm, I'm never just not sure of the situation. I, I I don't know. I mean, if we've got stuff documented, I I, I don't know. Can. Yeah. I guess there's not that much more they can really take off of him, but... An imposter. Oh, hi. Is anybody a doctor? Uh, I doctors just came into town. Yeah. Okay, because Eugene's in there and he really needs some help, I think. I'm gonna Eugene? drop this off in the office. Okay. okay. Um, the doctors should be right here. Okay, thank you. He's already passed out several times from least of blood, you know. Right. Uh. Turn to Blackwater to rearm and reassess. Pavis is here. Meet with a rabbit. No! No! I'm gonna grab those. They said at the same time, 218. This report probably oh, not great. here. We need a dock ASAP and Valentine. Don't tell me how works. Okay, we should really probably head toward Blackwater. Okay. I I Oh, well, Pavis is in to uh, Armadillo, so... I... I know, but look at... Look at both Rabbit and Pavis's tips. <sighs> they are... Hopefully they run into one another? Hopefully, I sure hope so, but hope they so. might not. Hello! Alright, let's, uh... The doctors are here, so let's... Mm. Let's get going down to Blackwater if we can. Calm down. Easy, easy. Easy, easy, easy. Calm down. All right, let's. Uh, where's is Thorn here? Okay. And is Thatcher coming? Where'd he go? Uh, oh, there he is. He's behind. Okay.
All right, we all ready to go? Yep. Oh. All right, is that even wet, Elliot? All right. I don't want to take the point. I would like to get up here. Sure. You know your way from uh Mitchell, he said he's gonna lead. Alright. Get him some experience with that. Right. Mm -hmm. So uh if, if we just had Pretty much south down the hill, uh, you'll be in a good way towards it. Down this hill in front of us, I usually Aye. don't head this direction. Okay. Now you'll find the river once we get down there. All right, exit. We'll uh, I'll meet then with the how uh, many this guy? One, uh, two, two. All right. All right. Yeah, right down the road here. And right. And right. <sighs> this this hurts. This hurts. Touch it. Ah. I understand how people don't understand my way. Oh, this is just excruciating. Nobody knows directions! Left on the road. Right. Make it Coming left up on the road. first. Uh, picking it up, I guess. And try and let us know when you're going to start sprinting your horse and when you're going to stop. Okay. Okay. Understood. Understood. We'll pull, back. we'll pull back and we'll stay at this pace for now. Okay. If I said, uh, we go, go right, off road down here. Right. If I said yes, north, we off road, but when I crossing meant, the river here. Right. Crossing the river. If I said north when I meant south, then I, I guess I'm just hopeless. It... I left uh, on the road up here. Making a left. Uh, folk and left. Straight off road here. All right, going off road. Watch rocks. Turn around. Now he seems like he knows where he's going. He just didn't understand how you can go down that hill by limpany. No one does. <laughs>
Mitchell roots and shortcuts map with horse tips on the back. I'm not perfect. I'll send a tip that we're here. All right. I'll uh, ride by with her. Okay. That would be very cool. It'd be so useful. kind of scary because if the the hoods are still out doing this stuff I could All right, you set. My, I could end up getting got by them tonight person on a date and lured her out of town supposedly with about six other people no idea where they could be Sorry, Sheriff, you, you said anything to me and here I have not heard it. Nothing much at all, don't worry. <laughs> Did you and Papa's meet on the Wii? I she caught up with me. Just, I heard Claymore put a box inside for you all. It had some different types of food on the inside. When you all are done with it, could you just let him know so I can get the uh, crate back? I think we have an empty uh, crate I... in there if we just want to give her that. All right, let me uh, look. I think I need to write a report about Arthur Johnson's body, so I'm going to start doing that. But uh, there's a, somebody I... requesting Siska transport back. Peter Gray, you said? Yes. All right. Uh... I don't think there's any point in hunting for the hoods at this stage. I you agree. know, they didn't do anything violent. They all they took from me, frankly, was my navy revolver and uh, my journal, which stings a little bit. But you know, nothing major. They didn't lay a finger on me, so. They didn't take your pump. Oh, I didn't have my pump. I was off duty at the time. Uh, oh, here we go. Here's an empty crate. Thank you very much. No problem. Oh, 
Um, uh, words ain't nothing. So I... What was that, Thorn? Um, I'm looking at the... Um, so I'm adding from the most recent in uh, incident where they kidnapped uh, Joey Crawford. Uh, Rick, Rick Stone's Maverick Stone. His, uh, his charges, but I went all the way down to the first incident. Is that, stream uh, acting weird, Marshall guys? Because it's Ortega, showing red uh, to me on my KDS, together. but my KDS um, is like really, really fast. The it is. I, it is still I, desecration of a corpse. I, I hate. I hate to be in defense of the cannibalism charge here, but surely cannibalism encompasses desecration of a corpse. Uh, it doesn't. Surely, unfortunately, well, no, because it can be committed against people who are still alive and mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. It's, oh, it's, Lord. it's an additional thing. Yeah. So yep. the grave robbing charge is the act of uncovering a grave in order to steal a person's belonging or removing I'll a person. I, 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 I also don't hate it. Leave me I also here hate with it. it. <laughs> 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 no, I'm kidding. Okay, what were you asking first? Um, just is it considered grave robbing because they stole the corpse out of the um, well, mortician's from I, care? Yeah, from what I understand, it was left with the mortician, so it is destruction of evidence. Still. Okay. Destruction of evidence. Okay. <laughs> Stop. I mean, it. active investigation. Public disturbance. Sure. Psychologically. <laughs> Emotional torture to everyone who has to work yeah. on this. False imprisonment what? if he's not alive. No. Oh. What are, I'm joking. What case what? are we talking about? What What is happening? We're just very All upset. Right, Doctor Johnson died. Animals. Oh Jesus. And apparently, the coping mechanism for grief is this conversation. Look, I mean, I could say something, but I'm holding back. There no, was literally ahead. just a tip no. saying, hey, we there found it. the body, come to Valentine. And then I get there, and they're telling me that it was eaten, and it's left up there in pieces. I, that wasn't okay. what I was expecting to walk into. Do we know who killed him? No, but the townspeople think they do, so they're probably out there hurting her right now. Good, great. I love it. I love yep. vigilantes. Oh yeah, so Speedy I apparently. Have Rip removed from the force. What? Wait, what? Did he? For what I just had to hear. What did you say? reaction? <laughs> That's fair. It's it is fair. It's so it's bad fair. that you're agreeing that it's fair. It's fair. It's fair. It was fucked up. That's okay, I, I don't want to hear. Coming it. from me, <laughs> it was fucked up. <laughs> How much are those thick journals? Time. What the They're fuck? Like, they're twenty dollars. Right? Yeah, thirty dollars. Thirty dollars. Cinder, what are you getting into? Where's cannibal? You're oh, so it's cute. Violent. I love you so much. You so cute, puppy. It was only a three hundred twenty dollar robbery, huh? I think I hear an right. ass out there. Well, if Peter Gray needs to, is, is he ready for pickup? Yeah, it does. Okay, do we want to take two or three people, go get him? I don't mind. Sure, I'll come along. All right. Should take the cadet too, if he's still here. He is, I see his Aye. little hat bobbing around out there. He's just talking about out the, there all alone. You're talking about the transport? Aye. Is he, is he ready for it? He is. Okay. His paperwork's through and everything. Let's go Aye. to San Denis. All right. Uh, can we get one other to come with us, just in case there's uh, bloody hoods waiting for us? I'm I'm going on the transport. Okay. okay. I was gonna. I've been picked up by him after. Did you read my report from last night, Winters? I did. Yes. Wait. Wait a minute. What? Your horse giving you issues. Uh -huh. I don't want to talk about it. Uh huh. This explains so fucking much. <laughs> All right, Thatcher, my oh, we are going to Siska. Thatcher, you've had uh, one of the largest amounts of Siska transport oh, visitations as a cadet that I've I've ever seen. Every time I come on duty, all hell breaks loose. But maybe that's just how things is. I don't know. Yeah, that's about right. Hi. Mitchell, would you like to lead the way or no? Aye. Get the no. cadet to do it. I, what am I doing? Do 
All right, Thatcher. You're leading uh, us to San Denis. San Denis, okay. Right. Someone's right. horse is. Oh. Is it? It's not my horse, is it? Uh, uh, is we going to the telegram station first? Maybe I'm. Maybe I'm imagining things. Uh, I I can I can run and send a tip. Is my horse being strange? Let me let me see. If you jump no, on fine. me and rip my me off my horse, <laughs> rabbit. I'm not gonna jump. On <laughs> Heidi Mills. Is everything okay? Just peachy saffron and yourself. Well, I'm doing great. I like to think that Mills has some respect for Saffron. It's fine, Rebbe. You know that's not something I was going to be doing. Honestly, the, the reason I surrender is because I didn't have a long arm, so. Uh, we'll go uh, one, two, one, I suppose. One, two, right. one. And we'll be going right off road uh, just beyond the graveyard here. Right. Did I say south or did I say north? What did I actually say, planet? You can be honest with me. Right? I did say south. Okay, so people just don't listen to me! I was right! I try to be as directionally unconfusing as possible by using the cardinal directions. Did it work? No! Didn't. Who? Welcome to the one three. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just avoiding the rocks, okay? Gonna <laughs> clip again. <laughs> I'm not mad. I sense no anger in the way you're yelling in frustration. <laughs> 